What's up, my boy? From that city with juice, ain't no pity or truces. When we dip in gun smoke's conclusive. Don't act clueless, hella bullish in the 90s. And GP shotgun when we ride. Solid on the yard, name hard on these streets. Did my crimes, gangster rhymes on dope beats. Still fuck laws, ain't no pause in our demeanor. Rest in peace, Muggsy and my road dog creeper. Ways to put it down, no fear of new cases. Years ago, though, it was guns and chases. 714 on my shoulders, kept it active. Roll like soldiers, G code ain't passive. Still Mac and Ratchet, still packed at the waist. Still stacking racks, still flash when they hate. Now it's podcasts and videos with pretty hoes. Me and George banging orange till the city's known. Really though. OG1. We keep it moving smooth like every day. In this industry, we do we on these streets for shop. Streets for shop. We make that green, don't you put your boot? We make it moves all day, all day, all day, all day. Grew up in the streets of the LB. We don't love these hoes, what they tell me. Packed up and moved to the OC. Me and George born in life, Shaq and Kobe. Fuck bitches get money, living wealthy. Bad bitches screaming, let me get a selfie. Big stop, she be some real G. Side dick is the general of an army. Egg she podcasting in the morning. Don't say F A, here's your warning. That other bullshit be boring. With some goofy ass question, that's corny. Tommy, let me finish my story. Shooting shots, game six, rubber ore. Smoking blunts in the bus while I'm touring. Now, welcome to George Perez Stories. OG Way. We keep it moving smooth like every day. Every day. They could not look that homie, we don't know. We don't know. It's going down for sure, for sure. Real G's in this industry. What's up, my boy? George Perez right here of George Perez Stories, episode 340. As you could tell, I haven't shaved. I look a little tired. Working. Gracias once again. Friday, Comedy Store. Saturday, San Diego. And me and X did a secret show for a Christmas party. Once again, gracias to all the gente out there. And uh, yo... But I keep it going, guys. You know, this is what we do. So welcome back, George Press Stories, episode 340. The vibes are feeling great, you know. Uh, X to the BZZT, what it be? In the his nows. You know there was an earthquake. An earthquake? <laughs> Today. Hold on, though. Why, why did you say that? Like like a paisa. There he's no, like, earthquake. You said earthquake. You know, you know, it was an earthquake. <laughs> no, but hey, for, it was a, there was an earthquake today at like seven thirty, right? Seven thirty. Yeah. How, how did how do you feel 3. about earthquake? Three point five, three point nine. That's good. That's nothing. That's nothing. Who rich Chris? Seven point eight. Hey, like, hey, like at a three point five, those the crossing guard was told that the kids cross the street over there. They were like, oh, go ahead. Keep going. Like, oh, what was that? Yeah. No, they don't even feel. They don't even. No, they, they'll pull them like, from what? the desk. Hey, get out! Get out of that. Desk. Anything under six, they don't even bother. They're like, no, oh, keep going. We're still doing our thing. But the earthquake last time in Ridgecrest, it, it lasted for seven minutes of shaking. Yeah, imagine how like shaking, like like like, like, like the Atlanta Freak Nick shaking, like just like or like you can't walk. No, 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 like it was just like the first minute or the first minute was like doo, 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 like like crazy food like people were able to run outside and film the poles and the poles were going like this and they're like look at this look at this and they're like in the parking lot everyone's going crazy and running like they don't know what it was so people are filming instead of getting like, Cause, no because they stuff? didn't know what they're like they didn't know what it was they're like this ain't no earthquake dude yeah 
X to the G, what it be, doggy What's dog? up? What's up? I was going to ask you, do you remember the 1989 San Francisco earthquake? Yes, I do. I was 12 years old. How bad right? was it? Was it? Do you remember, like, like not traumatizing, but you were like, yo. Look, homie, I was in seventh grade. We're at Patola Junior High School in the city of Orange. That's in Northridge? No. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, homie. You didn't hear right now San Francisco? Oh, the San Francisco one. And, uh... I remember feeling it, but not like you, you. But you were in class. No, we were playing on the playground. Okay, and like it's like anything, dog. Um, I don't know, man. Some people can sleep through them or walk through, but like you already know, dog. I'm the kind of fool. Xavier's been on a plane with me. I'd be like, "Yo, dog, the left engine sounds like an uh, dog transmission." Oil. Oh, like, we, we were we were flying one time, <laughs> and there was tape. You know how sometimes they put tape, but it's like real. It's, I, honestly, it does look sketchy. But he pointed it out. He saw me, and then I was like, why you got to tell me? What am I going to do, dog? Now, I'm worried that there's tape on the plane. Dog, Can they you tape, a fool, they taped it by the engine. Yeah. <laughs> you know, right there like that, dog. You ain't going nowhere. Hey, fool, and they use, like, the tape that you, like, the silver one, eh, the, the, what is <laughs> the duct tape. No, but it was, like, the better one. Oh, the, the aluminum the tape? the gas. Yeah, the aluminum tape. Yeah. But anyways, <laughs> yo, guys, I want to give a shout out to George Perez Story Sponsors. George Perez Stories is brought to you by JB and Sons Tree Service Landscape and Installation. Look, people, if your lawn needs to get cleaned up like Tommy's Grill, hit up my boys at <laughs> JB and Sons Tree Service Landscape and Installation. They do sprinklers, landscaping, tree removal, stump removal, gardening, anything to do with the lawn or a backyard or like like say you own apartment buildings like you ever been to those apartment buildings and they got those high weeds on the side yeah dog homies in, the middle, in between yeah like they go and down. like they look like plants now you're like hey this weed is big you're like, is this fucking are those sunflowers yeah five bucks Hit them, my boys, at JB and Sons Tree Service Landscape and Installation on Instagram at JB and Sons Tree Service Landscape and Installation. And if you want to talk to the big homie, hit up my boy Jesus at J M B A R R I O S Twizzle. X, how you feeling, dog? Good, feeling good, good. I, uh, I'm surprised that you're not a little bit mad at me. Hey, what did you do this time? Remember, we were driving, and at the end of the road, I almost. Thought I ran over something, and I looked at you, and you. You did at me. run it over. It fell off the car, then you ran it over. Yeah, but I. I, I what th- did you run over, dude? I thought that that was the end of my tour life. I was that. That was it. 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 it was oh, it. You didn't want to know, dog. <laughs> That's it for you, dog. It was the end, and so close to making it home, and we pull over to. You know me. I need cigarettes, dog. <laughs> Yo, what is this? Let me tell the story, dog. So we go to, we go to Chula Vista, doing a show for charity, dog. Yeah. The kids over there in Chula Vista. Some of them don't even have Fetty. I go on field trips to get backpacks. Oh. Fools are going to school like we used to with all their, like, you know what I mean? And yeah. Come on, homie. A kid should have a Hey. A kid should have a backpack. Am I right or am I wrong? Yeah, even if you're crossing the border, you need a backpack. Yeah, no, but, like, if schools can't supply backpacks, but you can give these kids surgery. The schools should have backpacks, huh? No, no, but what I'm trying to say is, so, you you got money to give them surgery. But you got money to get him a backpack? Ooh, child, things are going to get easier. Ooh, child, things are going to get brighter. Did you have a backpack, homie, yeah. in sixth grade? Got money for war, became feeble. Nah, homie, stop right That's there, That's where I dog. got that from. Yeah, but. Did I get one? Actually, it's from the movie Boys in the Hood when he I lived his dad. It. He goes, I love this song. Yeah, he loves her. Sick one, huh? Yeah. No, but what were you, were you asking me? What Did, backpack did you have? I had a Jansport. Yeah, like, I see. Uh, you the regular. dance sport. You're regular. Wrangler? Hey, no, I had like a, so a backpack. There you go. Like, Tommy, make something uh, up. Wrangler? Uh, uh, you say Wrangler? Player. No, no, not a, uh, like a weird. Like, He's like, I, I got backpack. it from Bon Jovi. But when I was little, I had a, like a Ninja Turtles backpack. <laughs> <laughs> Quick with him. And fool, and I'm saying, if the homie had one with the shell, fool, and we would come out kicking. Like that, dog? Fool, I would do spin. Look at that. Just like that, fool, on the backpack. Damn! Like the with the three Ninja Turtles, you know what I'm saying? I thought and then there was no, four. No, it was four of them, but none <laughs> had three. 
Fool, we're not going to have three plates. <laughs> yeah, dude. Three just, turtles just and just three, three plates. Three turtles, eh? <laughs> but, hey, I had a backpack with, <laughs> with the Ninja Turtles on it. How many oh, zippers did it have, dog? Was it like custom? The the, whole, the side was a little zipper, and then oh, the top one, and then the, the inside. On. And the inside, you would open it, had a zipper, and you could put stuff in the back. Okay. That's the one I threw in the fucking desert when I was getting chased by the dog, eh? <laughs> 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 on the way, fool, when I would ride the bus home, <laughs> every day we would get chased by. There was always a, a like a loose dog. Hold on, you just hear what you said? Did you hear what you just said? Every time I would ride the bus, we'd get chased by a dog. How's the dog? No, because when I would go, the bus would drop us off at the bus stop, and we'd have to walk home. But that whole walk home was like. It was a one wild. dog was waiting for and you, huh? There was always a, a couple dogs, but one dog. Was, dogs. There was a boxer, and that fool, you wouldn't see him from far away, and I'd be like, "Damn!" And I would see him, and I would already know, start booking it, and I would just run. And now, if he got Summer close, Radiana. if he got close, I would just throw the backpack and just. Uh, run. And then my dad would have to come pick me up later on and be like, "He's a don't know how to say." So I'd be like, "Fucking looking out the window, it's right there." I'm telling you. Uh, dog, that's crazy. It, it, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let, let, let X, you said it, dog. Nah, <laughs> I, I, I believe this story for some reason. Did you have a backpack, a cool one? Nah, fool, but what, you know you know me, dog. You know what I did have? What? I had the 50, the 50, the 50 set Crayola color or whatever. Oh, the set with the all the set crayons? had the whole and then the, set. The, the racer on the side? The racer and everything, That was dog. cool in sixth grade? No, dog. no, not the racer. The, no, the sharpener sharp, on the yeah. side. You'd be like, Phew. Well, yeah, I thought that I was a baller, dude, because I thought I was an artist. And I was like, dog, I was like, apa, compramelo. Yeah, I mean, like, apa. Apa, yeah. Hey, it was only like eight, ten bucks, huh? You used to draw? Yeah. And you don't draw no more? No, nah, I'm like you. I I, I, inter- I like apprentice at a tattoo shop when I no was like way. 19. Yeah. Damn, yeah. look at this fool. Are you going to get tattered by him? <laughs> <laughs> God, this fool spells everything wrong, dog. That's why he got fired. Be like, He's that I'm one fool, dog. No regards. No, <laughs> no <laughs> regards. Oh, what is this? Always spelling shit wrong. Yeah, homie, I didn't. I didn't have a backpack, dog. I didn't have a backpack. You're a folder kid. You walk around with your folder with your. With your... <laughs> it's not that I was a folder kid. Is um, when I went to school, dog. Like they didn't let you take your books home. No. Nah, you could only take that one book. So look, dog. We'd have to go to the library. And then they'd open that up, dog, and stamp, and we'd have to sign a paper, and we couldn't graduate unless we returned all our books, Damn. or our parents had to pay for that oh, book. Oh, there was a pay- Yeah, I remember when you would write your name on a backpack. Yeah, and uh, so uh really didn't have backpacks, dog, and it was more of a... I rode my bike to school, dog, or I yeah. walked it, so it was like... We were... Hey, when I was in sixth grade, homie, it was uh me, technical foul raw. Um, Nestor, Stanley, Corey Jackson, dog. This fool was like six foot. Yeah. He was huge, dog. <laughs> you put her on little. Dog, this fool was huge. And he was a, he already had a mustache in sixth grade, dog. Yeah. Yeah, but he was not a bully to like. He was a bully only if you were like an older kid trying to mess with him because he looked old. Yeah. And we had Jesse Lopez. Um, man, I don't want to miss nobody, dog. Let me think about this one. It was Jesse Lopez, uh, Joey Cork, but he was, he came later, but he was the homie. Uh, Glenn Vega. Uh, I know I missed some homies, yeah. dog. But, hey, it is what it is. And, hey, dog. We would all like walk to the park and like race each other or like try to convince girls to come kiss us and hold our hand up. <laughs> and 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 would well, you race to get to <laughs> Mac a girl? Yeah, like, <laughs> Take one. You, hey, like you know, um, it's kind of like what, uh, like a bird f- for him to impress the girl. He's a peacock, his hair like a peacock. Really, right? Like a peacock, yeah, straight up peacock in a dog. Yeah. So, hey, fool. Like, I would hurt myself. <laughs> I remember like, me and my I cousin would, Johnny raced to make out with I, a girl. Can I end it, player? <laughs> After I say hurt myself, I'm going to describe why. I'd be running, dog, and the fool the fool's going to beat me, fool. And I would just, like, jump at the end. Oh, and do, like, a roll, but still lose it. 
<laughs> and then the hind, and then and then you know those fake stuff. You're like, oh my leg, hey, go. <laughs> no. And then, oh. and then like when the hind gets her, you okay, George? I'm good now. <laughs> Sick one. Player, dog. You know what I'm saying, you know, I had something in the pocket for him. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I will. For, I pull out the uh, the watermelon uh, lollipops, dog, with the chile. <laughs> Homie, in sixth grade, that was baller. That was money. And plus, nobody in Orange really... We had, like, certain stores. Orange is like a Mexican white 50s city at this time. Yeah. Later on, it just got took over by Raza. Everybody that had money for Santana moved to Orange afterwards. I was just like, hey. <laughs> They're like, we're going over there. You know, we're going to go to Orange, homie. It's, yeah. it's Chicano culture with the two car garage. Eh? Yeah, hey, nobody nobody uh had candy Mexican candy back in the day. No, they did, and... dog, but like Orange had like the Mexicans that lived there had money too, so the bigger like we used to have a uh what is it called, El Marquido? Marque, la Mercado? Mercado. Mercado. Yeah. We, it was a, like that's like OG market, right? Yeah. Was was Orange a good spot to go trick or treating? Hell yeah, yeah! They got down with the big like chocolate bars and king size shit. Who's always talking about uh, when they go to those houses? They give you the big chocolate bars. I never went anywhere trick or treating where they give you the big size candy. You don't know where you to go. Had to, now you had to go to. Villa I never Park have for that. You have? Where? I'll Villa go Park. right now. I'll go this next year. Yeah, go to Villa Park, player. Where? Go to Villa Park, <sighs> Newport. My mom used to take me Newport because oh. <laughs> we used to live in Huntington. They give you the big candies there. Oh, dog! They give you anything. They give you the house. No, they were like, go ahead, come yeah. in, stay tonight. <laughs> <laughs> <All right. laughs> did, you, did you go trick-or-treating in Ridgecrest? <sighs> all day. Barely like five houses. What are you Ooh, talking about all day? Well, you would go to like some neighborhoods and then you could hop around. But there were <laughs> neighborhoods where you could go in, in, in trick-or-treat. Sick. All right, guys, let's uh, talk about some real stuff. I know, trick, tr- 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 come on, homie. Me and trick-or-treat with trick-or-treat in. So what's hey, cracking? did I tell you we kicked it with Bushwick Bill? Okay, Bushwick let's... Bill, we, and we, uh, were you there, Xavier? No, we, uh, E Zone. He was performing, rapping. Bah, 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 bah. E Zone and, was rapping. Yeah, yeah he was when rapping. Was this? And me and my brother went to, with E Zone. When was this? Like two thousand twenty years. It was right before. It, well, I think I was, was there like four years ago. Had yeah. to been like three years ago. How long? How long before had COVID Bushwick or Bill after? Passed away. Because Bushwick Bill passed away already. It's been like three, four years. I'll look it up right so now. So it was no, before that. Because he doesn't know how to spell Bushwick. Them. What about it, though? Okay, so you met no, him. So we, we, met, uh, we were right there at the party kicking it. And then Bushwick Bill was right there. For some reason, he was there. And we were in the back. And uh, He we died fucking... June, 19, June 9th, 2019. So this yeah, is four damn. years ago. Dog. Yeah, so 19, 2018, yeah, I met him. Then? Yeah, he's always rapping like around five, six years with, ago. Uh, with, with, he was with um, Cray. Who's Cray? Cray OC. Okay. I don't know who that is, but it's all good. I'm not, yeah, and not well, putting him, it down Well, they either. were over there, and uh, we me kicked it with Bushwick Bill. We were blazing it, and he was like, hey, d- uh, don't get me on video or anything smoking and shit. I guess because he couldn't be burnt out that he was blazing it. Man, but we didn't know he is was Is Bushwick Bill the little one? Yeah, Bushwick Bill the little yeah. So this little asshole couldn't hit it. He he no he couldn't he could blaze it but he he's like don't take videos or bit uh, vi- uh, pictures with me blazing it. Like, I don't right. think no one's gonna be mad at a dwarf that's well, a no. hip hop. I think well, he was trying to make like some video or something on All his right. life. But yeah, Bushwick Bill. Damn. So what? Ha- what? Why did you bring this up? Because I, I we were talking about trick or treating uh, um, when talking it right up. <laughs> 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 this year Halloween fell on the yeah, weekend. Yeah. Me and Ghetto Boys is trick or treat yeah. in. So that's why robbing I'm... little kids for bags. No, so uh, talking about concert, you did best on mucho, right? Yeah. Were you back there trying to like sing to people? Before, did you learn that, something before, because those bookies the, like, were there? The like the lineup was Dog, dope. All of them. First you of all, can up? you give a better intro? You didn't go there. You well, were he, working. Yeah, working I know. There. People were like, "Oh, you were there." I was like, "Fool, I was working." So what time did you get there? At four. In the what morning? time did you leave your pad? I left my pad. I, I left my pad to get there like at two or something. I got to work. Damn. Early. Got to work early. Got there. And then. Did, fool, the, did the Heine give you a lunch or no, a fed that was a, fool, I, I, fool, okay. I was working, building it. My car. <laughs> I gave the homie a jump start. Uh-huh. And my car took shit right there. Yeah, your and car I had to leave it tables. overnight. I had to leave it overnight right there with a the little sign, don't toll. <laughs> yeah, like, like a work, stripper. I was at work. Like a stripper. Yeah, right put there. That, boom. Hey, hey don't toll. I'm going to be back in the morning, <laughs> eh? So I went. I w- 
hey, you know, my brother's like, hey, he's like, don't trip. My brother went to go try to help me. He's like, oh, no, we got to fucking leave it here. We'll come in the morning. Because we said. thought it was a battery. So we went to the house. We charged the battery. Here. My father-in-law's house, boom. Because he has he has a, a low rider. Here, so he, I was like, I know he has a charger. So he charged the batteries over the battery over there. Took it back. It wasn't that. Damn. 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 So we had to tow it. Tow it to my house. This is in the morning. I had to work that afternoon. So I towed it to my house. Oh, waited forever for the tow truck. Had to do all these circles to get the car. Finally got it. Took it to my house. Took the battery out. What's wrong? Got the starter. And then I, that's where I had to go into fucking uh, the mechanic mode. You? The mechanic just poof. No, you got too? to mechanic. But nothing. <laughs> no, my brother was like, <laughs> my brother was like, oh, do that one, do that one. We, we, we did it, but we got. Did, the, did you have all the equipment? Because that's the yeah, worst part we, when you we don't had have all the tools. tools. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tools, yeah. yeah. My, well, my brother was right there. My brother went over there to help me. Fool, since six in the morning, we were over there trying to get this thing going, and then we, uh, I put the starter in, and boom, started right up. Then I got ready, everything, went to work. And then uh, it, I was right there. I see everybody. I heard they hit you up. Hey, puedes cantar con nosotros. Like, back up. They were big. no, but los bookies, fool. They're old. They're old, fool. Like they how they, old, X? They're eighties. Eighties. Yeah. 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 I'll yeah. look it up right now. Sorry, I had to now. confirm it. No, <laughs> these fools are eighty, probably eighty four. So hold something. on, hold on. But yeah, so you get to work. What's going on when you get to work? No when one's get, there yet. No, everyone's there. There's buses already. No, parked? when I get there, there's already. Yeah, it's like oh, you didn't can't, you have to set you it have up to go through here? Yeah, we set it up. We set it up for a week before. A week. Before? Yeah, because they, fool, they have they do safety they tests. Have five different stages. Oh, there's like a stage over here, a stage over there, a stage over here. Boom, way down there, two more stages. And you had, you had this something to do with all of them? No. Well, on some of them, because I had, because I just go. What was your main one? Like, which one did you, like, build or, on, like, construct on, on or whatever you call cl- it? Classico. <laughs> that's a classical stage. <laughs> that's classico. A, How come I know better Spanish than you right now? Los Tucanes de Tijuana. Los Ángeles Azules. Pepe Aguilar. Alejandro. Hey, so you uh, saw Fernandez. all them go up yeah. before? Fer- Vicente Fernandez, son. Yeah? Yeah, he was Who was, was right the there. first one to go up? The first one, well, from all, the, there was a grip of people. No, from what it you started see. at 11. In the day? Yeah. In the morning, it starts at 11. There's like 50 bands. And that different, it's like was the Roquero stage there? has like 15 bands the whole day. Like Mana, the, Camila. The Roquero, the, the classical stage has another 15 bands. The pop stage has another 15 bands. It's like the best of the best. Of what you hear on the radio and everything was right there. Okay, so everything. Now, what are you doing there now? Now that the stage is set yeah, up, are you there to make sure if anything fucks up? You yeah, got we're right there. It? Take it, we're just right there, making sure everything's right, everything's running right. Uh, like uh, we have to switch out the the bands, so make sure everyone's making sure when one band goes up, you bring out this band's equipment. Okay, get. Get the next shows, the next acts equipment up. So when they go up, we just set is this, it up. Is it like NASCAR? Are they timing you, like motherfucker? NASCAR. Like Vamos a, there's, a, it, it, there's a round, uh, a round, uh, big ass stage, and it, it's it has a wall in the middle, mm-hmm. and it and spins around. On this side, there's one band, and on this side, it's another band. So when it rotates, we take off this band, bring in the next, and this band's playing. Then it spins. We take off this band, this band starts playing, and we bring in the next one. Okay. It's like, like rotating, did, rotating back and I forth. Did that it's like the, when you did the Honda Center. Yeah. Remember? Okay, now let's get to, like, who did you like? Like, like The Tucanes. What time did they go on? They went on, like, at 7.30. It was anybody they before that whole, ball? Uh, they played for a whole hour, like, an uh, hour and 20 minutes. Damn. You're like, damn. Like, and they played nothing who but went the, up after the them? cut. From from then it, it was Tucanes and Angeles Azules. They're fired. They're off. bad. Do, 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 <laughs> did hey like did they follow them They're strong? Bad. What about the crowd, uh, homie? Was it Tia's? Fool ants. You seen everybody's Tia fools. Like oh, you seen everybody like Rancholos. Huh? Everybody fools. Fools traveled from anybody other recognize places. you, Tommy? Don't lie. Anybody was like, yo, three fool, plates. Fools, like, three plates. <laughs> 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 they fucking hit me up. What's cracky? <laughs> but yeah. Hey, does, does anybody say, hey, uh, 
I watch your podcast, and you're like, yeah. They're like, yeah, GPS. No, like, what's up? We're George. Because no one ever watches it. Hey, no one be watching Holding It Down, dog. I go to your views, and I'm like, damn, dog. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to buy this for some views. We got to get some views, eh? Nah, but really you had Funk Freaks on. That one's going to be good, dog. Not that the other fools ain't good, but. Oh, yeah. Funk Freaks was on. They were tight. Uh, we had a good time. So, so who'd you book at the concert? I know you were out there like, yo, no, do my no, podcast. No, I know no, you told those age. bookies, dog. You told my I told fucking. Camila? I got, no, I got the, uh, that uh, Pepe Aguilar. You told him? Or you he's told his manager? Don't lie. He's going to be on the 40. Pepe Aguilar is old. No, he's not old. Not too old. He He's probably like, what, 50? 50, yeah. When you're Mexican like that, um, like when you're from Mexico, you're, you're not going to eat the American processed food. You're yeah. going to get more of like a homegrown canola ex. Yeah. And uh, that's why a lot of those singers live long, dog, because they're like, no, that yo quiero chiles y gallinas from my backyard. Like yeah. It's, it's all from there. Tommy, why don't you have chickens at your house? You have that big backyard. I know. I should get <coughs> chickens. I always want to get goats, too. <coughs> For what? I'm about Just goats. to have goats. I don't know, because goats seem like they're pretty cool. No, at know, night, the coyotes are going like to... Could a coyote goats? fucking go to? Oh, yeah. They team up. Goats Ooh, are... Goats I was... Are, okay, like speaking pack, about... They're wolf pack. Speaking about a coyote's fool, I was waiting outside for the tow truck to come and fix my car first. <laughs> <laughs> outside of the Dodger Stadium room right there, because he's like, oh, you're going to meet him outside and at the address. Oh, so there's hills right I went there. outside, and fool, I, I heard like... Uh, wrestling in the bushes and I was like what I look back I thought it was like somebody right there I was like what and fool a coyote comes out all big I was like oh like a side to get coyote just, he just looks at me and he's like whatever he just keeps walking I was like I was all stiff right there and then boom another one comes out I was like damn what the hell is going on there's a grip of coyotes up there you didn't be like oh nah I w- oh. If, I, if he would have turned around I would have been like ah like, like, for sure I would have fucking okay <laughs> remember that one lady get Tell them I would have fucking threw my shoe at his ass. Get out of here, punk! Hey, dog. Uh, I, I've had I've had homies lose pets Dang. to coyotes, like while walking them. No and, way, for yeah, real. And then I'm not gonna say the name, but like I had a homie that like set up. He set it up, dog. He's like, look, the coyotes always come at this time on Sunday. Because they got two of his pets, dog, and it was on camera. Yeah. So this fool, they they booby trap fools. Like, fools are laying, like, covered in bush with cuetes ready, dog, with silencers. And took out every coyote. Yeah, on that no, hey, dog. They don't even go to that anymore. No, like, like, uh... You ever yell at your dog for pissing on your rug, and he like he walks by that rug like, damn, man, eh? I don't like this corner. I got yelled at. Hard <laughs> yeah, I remember here. getting bombed on. It here. scared those other coyotes, dog. Yeah. In rich cars, you could shoot coyotes. Yeah. If you see those, like you could go in the desert, like just for. Are fun. you allowed to shoot them? You could go out there in the desert just for fun and shoot them. I don't know if in California, but if they're an invasive. Animal, yeah, you're allowed it, to shoot. Well, yeah. in rich cash there's a grip of them everywhere. Yeah, they're like, there's they're like, that many, uh, yeah, you're probably allowed to. So you could go in the desert and just blast them. But and, it, fool, can you blast a coyote? It, if it's eating my pets, dog, it's, it's on. Yeah. It, hey, dog. Fool, my, what if you came in the backyard, dog, and Donna was right there being chewed by five of them, dog? dog my, my neighbor, fool, one time I walked out and it was just a little head. You already oh, said the story. Yeah, that's what I'm telling you. Coyotes yeah. ain't playing, dog. So, yeah, what so he, what he just told you, if they got Donna, are you shooting that fool? I'll get them. All of them? Work. Y'all come here with the fucking coyote jacket. What's <laughs> up? <laughs> okay, like, what happened? You know what happened. <laughs> the little teeth right here like this. But you know what, though? And I, I say this just by how I say this how I feel and live. Like, uh, that's another world, dog. Where, like, nature plays different reglas than us yeah. nature has different there's no rules but there is rules yeah yeah you know, they have rules the little animals yeah but like like i think it's messed up when a human is like okay look we're gonna build where you guys used to live and Ooh. but don't be fucking with our pets they do that all day yeah like well, hey dog i watched this video the other day and a fucking eagle had a puppy in its nest, dog. And he nah. was about to, like, rip it up. And a give puppy? It. Yeah. No. And I was like, 
What was it? One of those gore videos or something? Nah, George been going down that rabbit hole watching lions eat something. No, and I don't watch them eat. Like, like it shows you like oh, nature is. Yeah, like ma- like nature's metal. metal. Yeah, you I mean, don't get mad at me. I don't, but you sent me, not that I care, but I know what he's going because you sent me a couple of them and they're pretty bad. It's that <laughs> hey, nature is metal. Or... But when you listen to those things, you you hear them and you're like, hey, those are the noises that people, when they say they hear Bigfoot or something. Yeah. I'm like, that's the noises that they're hearing. It's like they're just waiting a mountain and a bear probably got a deer and it's all, wow. Yeah. And they're like, well, what was it's, that? It's like, it's a deer getting Hey, Fo, but check this out. What if me and you were like, Little bobcats, and we heard that. We, we, I'm mean, like, yo, it's time to bounce. Oh, it's on. Like the big homies putting in work. Yeah, you hear that? You're like, hey, let's roll. <laughs> yeah. Time to go. Time to go. Hey, <laughs> hey all right, for I'm gonna let, hey, if we were all in the jungle, okay, what, where would we be in, in nature or the jungle? I mean, nature's the if jungle. If we were animals, what would we? I, I think in like, uh, yeah, if we were animals, dog, in Africa, what would we be? I'd be a hyena. I think I'd be a good hyena too, laughing and shit, just running away. Eating, oh. eating. yeah. Hey, hyenas get beat up, but they put in work. They too, put in work, dog. but they're like only the scavengers. lion can get them, right? Only the lion can nah, get them. Nah, they get stomped out by all that, like hippos. Do you never yeah. seen the video? The hippos get them because they try to get the little the little babies. They they're gonna they, eat. Yeah, those but they're down pain. for theirs. What's Tommy then? Tommy. Me? Lion. Yeah. Nah, fool. Come oh, on, fool. Nah. What am I then? Hold on, hold on. Like, I got to be a sick-ass animal, fool. You're like a... An anteater. Nah, <laughs> you're the... A, a war- badger. A warthog. A warthog? Yeah, a warthog, yeah. <laughs> Hey, nah, but are, like a one down the, one though. Yeah, those are one of the craziest. A boar, a there. boar, a yeah. boar, a wild boar. Nah, a wild boar. warthog is, take it. is which one's it. crazier? A warthog. Yeah, that's who you are, dog. Yeah, boars you got get hunted. Hey. Ooh, ain't nobody So, get you know why he's crazier? Because his teeth come are, out all over. Hey, hey, but you have them up here. Hey, do they eat those? Yeah. yeah Can you eat those? Because that's, that's not a, a pig. That's a that's pig. Not, but that's, that's not a wild boar, fool. It's a pig, It's though. different, though. I don't know about that. A warthog is like, uh, yeah, I don't know if you could eat them. You can, can you? Yeah, for sure, huh? Get over here, little punk. Or would I be, fool? Don't say chango either. What would George be? That would be one of those... Damn, you, you can break my man. heart. Dude. Come on, break his heart, Tommy. What would what 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 would be a good one for George? A good jungle, what the, the fucking jungle sneak? <laughs> <laughs> nah, you guys are sorry. You guys got know, no imagination. Fool, a good dog. one. Uh, uh, the laughing hyena. The 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 the, 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 the the wild dogs. I'm a little thing. No, come yeah, on. I don't say my friends no If I'm a warthog, <laughs> what, what the Xavier? Xavier? He's a he's hyena. Not a hyena dog. Xavier is yeah. a hyena dog. Well, like a those, prey mantis. I'd be a good prey no, mantis. This was a, yeah. one of those a crane, prey mantis is Those cool. crane birds. A prey mantis is that nah, low, the instinct. He's a vulture. That long. Dog, he's a vulture yeah. dog because he'll always be like, I'm down for the <laughs> leftover. <laughs> <laughs> He'd be like this. <laughs> Hey, but he would be like a vulture, and, and like he would be a fancy one. They'd be like, "Hey, where'd you get that feather?" He's like, "Oh, a lion bit one of my friends." <laughs> and I took it. Yeah, you're a vulture fool. If anybody's a hyena, it's Tommy, dog, with those teeth because hyenas can bite through bones. Can all they can digest bones? <laughs> oh yeah, a, they got they a good digestion system. Yeah, jaws. perro. But look, he's too big, though. Hyenas are fast, and they're just always joking no, around. Fool, That's not. me, fool. Yeah, come on, You dog. seen the fools out there in Africa with the hyenas like their pets? Yeah. But even those fools are like some crazy ass fools. They're, they have vests with, like, tire on them and chain. You're like, all right. Hey, People are like, oh, you what about that That's video? their pet that they would have. What about that video of the hyena holding the monkey and had them all calm, and she was talking like, like all crazy? George would be a good ostrich. Yeah, <laughs> <You know. laughs> are dope, dude. They're fast and they're dangerous. <laughs> they're they're not, no. ass. <laughs> Motherfucker, I'd be a fucking like an orangutan. Eh? I was thinking orangutan. I was yeah. like orangutan, but that's not like an African. But like I would be like, there. I would be like the only orangutan that would like like kicked it with like other animals and shit. Like, hey, this is so funny. Like I would show up, like I would show up, like what's up? Kicking, kicking back with fools. Yeah, I'd be, I'd be kicking it with like the because I. I'd be the fucking bear. the zebras or the giraffes and shit. 
the I, big old, the big if, I was a, if I was a orangutan, I would fuck other things that weren't orangutans. I'd be a good giraffe, too. I'd be a honey bear. I'd be a good giraffe. Because <laughs> you're, you're good at soccer for headers? Just fucking swing my neck around and shit. You're good giving head? <laughs> Some bears. This fool went to a giraffe. Though you don't have an ass. Giraffes have ass. Yeah, they do. Like horses. <laughs> what the Horses? Fuck? You ever seen a horse's ass? Giraffes <laughs> have like weird bodies. You know what I'm saying? Big old long. <coughs> they they go like this. If Tommy All right, had... homie. Let, let's let let let's move on from this. Thing, what the fuck? We're a we're we're. we're high. How high would you we're say high. you are? Like four blunts in. That's how high. Yeah, four blunts in, like hey, in forty is. minutes. What's up? Who who made that shirt right there? Suavecito. That's hard. Do this they own the, the original the one? Truck. Yeah. Well, the the cool story behind their truck that they have is the original guy who made the truck for the movie Mi Vida Loca. Yeah. Is some fool Danny. He he died. So, but like before he died, they went and they took him a truck, and they're like, "Hey, can you paint the we're you know we're Suavecito, we want to get uh, the truck painted, like the truck from the from the movie." And he's like, "I'm already doing it." And he's like, what? And he's like, yeah, I'm already painting it. So they're like, damn, let's get that. Can we get it? And he's like, well, you know, and they're like, hey, you know, let me, you let's need? get it. So they hooked him up fat. And he's like, all right. And he's, he's like, I'll paint the other truck. from they're like, do whatever you want to it. And he painted, they have a pink truck, Suavecita. And oh, it's a hot wow. pink one. They, and it's the original fool who painted the, the real truck from the movie. He remade the this truck now. Suavecito and Suavecita. Everything. It's a exact same truck. Like and it's a, made by the original dude who made the truck. Did you so ever cruise cool. down Whittier or Bristol? Yeah. Yeah, which one? I not Bristol, but uh Whittier Boulevard, Sixth Street Bridge. On the yeah. <laughs> this is my car right here, Pioline. Oh, Pioline, dog. So yeah. I cruise, and, then, and, and this is a Sixth Street Bridge right here. <laughs> That's not on Whittier. That's a Sixth Street Bridge right there. Bam. Okay, where's the car? Right here. The car got, hold on, so... That's, you're that's like Pioline, uh, dog. That's, Pioline. that's um, that's like Vermont. You're that's pretty far, dog. Here. Wait a minute, no. But for, I cruised on on Whittier Boulevard. How old you? Broke down on Whittier, Whittier Boulevard. But you weren't dressed like a gangster, or nothing, right? You were dressed like no, a greaser. I was just driving like this. Okay, driving my car with Pendleton. <laughs> Probably my arm out all sick, trying to smoking camel filters and shit. Okay, what about you, X? X, you've never been cruising in like Nah, for why are you cruising? Cause you know Bristol's by Costa yeah, Mesa. Yeah. You're like you'll get blasted. No, you go, you go fast on Bristol for me. Bristol, it, it, <laughs> yeah, Bristol was a cruise. very good cruising, but it's a part of Santana that like you're going through too many. The heart right there. No, Santana's heart is everywhere. It's just you're going through varios and fools don't care because there's hyenas and some fools don't know. Some fools get lost and they're fuck. Some fools cruise Bristol and they're like, damn, fool, my tires fucked up. You have to make a right to get out the street, and there's fools right there waving, dog. Deep. Yeah. Deep. Get these fools. Because think about it, dog. Let's say your neighborhood is off of Bristol, and you don't want fools to be like, oh, yeah, we drove by them fools' neighborhood. No one was leaving outside. Yeah. And no, these fools are there. <laughs> yeah. Like, no, you, you just hey, fools, if you break you down, have the tow truck come get it's you, over. player. Yeah, stay in the car. Again, sometimes Hannah oh. will set you up. They're like, hey, man. It's a badass Camaro. We're going to bring these fools to the neighborhood. You guys just jack them. It's hey, the hustle. I, I hey, mean, hey, dog. Hi-nuss my neighborhood didn't do up, that, huh? but it's what it is. Hynas, it's, they it's always the setting fools up, huh? You ever get set up, Tommy? I just seen that shit on Force 48. <laughs> <laughs> like when Hynas always said, it's always like some ver- chick that set fools up. They're like, oh, we just wanted some. F-. Like, it'll be some I whatever. I got set up before, but we got out of it. I don't want to say what happened, but yeah. We got no, it. well, the, the, it, it's uh, for have you ever had it set a high up? I did it once when it hurt my feet. eighth grade dog. This one chick was like, Hey, pretend you're gonna because at my school we fought at the handball courts at Portola, dog. And she was like, Hey, fool, do me a bottle like that. And yeah. you know, in eighth grade, when someone talks to you like that, like you think they're from the mafia, yeah, you're like, <laughs> in eighth grade, you're like, Oh, shit, this bitch watch America me twice. <laughs> you know, I, I gotta go, She's like, hey, do me a bottle, and I was like. Dime. Dime. <laughs> use me. Use, use this. Me. <laughs> I was like, Monday. And she was like, hey, fool. That Heine likes you, but, you know, 
Wah, 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 wah. Bitches talking shit to me in PE and they fucking, they broke my Walkman, dog. I gotta get mine. I gotta get suspended so my mom knows that's the reason my Walkman's broke or I'm gonna get my ass whooped. Yeah. But then she'll probably buy me a new Walkman, eh? Yeah. So I fucking took this high and I backed her dog, got a kiss out of it, and the other girl was like, hey, bitch, you broke my Walkman. And, she, and the other bitch was like, yeah, dog. No, she was like, you're like, oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yo, wait a minute. And hey, for, it filled up, dog, and it was an even fight, but the, the one that broke the Walkman, she was a bully, dog. She's strong. For, What's up, bitch? Yeah, she's like, I'll break that shit again. Yeah. What <laughs> you got? Like, ah. And it was it was the uh, the black, okay, so if this is the Walkman right here, do you remember the ones that had the EQ, the fake EQ? Yeah. It had high, mid. Oh, yeah. And you, the little three little things. <laughs> and it only went up a little bit, dog. Yeah. Oh, the technology. They would all be oh, turned man. up. Yeah, dog. Even you, in my car. If I turn on, you know when you tune in your own radio, I just turn everything up. Treble, bam, no, up. I can't. I do that. You don't have good ears. That's why. Be, everything <laughs> sounds good to you. Even your own singing, Tommy. Your own singing sounds good to you, bro. Remember the Sony Explodes? You used to have that? Fool, I used to walk around with house speakers like this. At the crib? No, on the street. No. <laughs> I put a generator on my belt. <laughs> You're all good. With, with the basket in the back of the car, Man, uh, the bike? You, you must have batteries for that, huh? What? If you did have a speaker and you carried it around? Yeah, those big ass dogs. You'd have that D. big ass dog. D. 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 Yeah. Did you have one of those big old, uh, like the stereos, like, you know, like the big old stereos that, with the big old speakers, like, yeah, the, you dog. had one of those, the old school ones. You, psh, it yeah, open. it was. It, it would. Uh, Hold on, let me tell you what it was. It was record, radio, tape player, equalizer, and then like, yeah, homie. But like, we didn't take care of our shit, dog. We had too many brothers and shit. Like fools would always take the speaker into the rest. Like, come on, homie, you can't take a fucking shower with the camera. <laughs> there we right there, the long bumping ass loud, liar on the ground. And then my mom, the would, my mom would turn it off and cut it. You motherfuckers are gonna electrocute yourself, <laughs> you stupid asses. Hey, but did you did you ever have the the little tape deck? Yeah, I had it like all. the like the ones that you could walk with. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, I had it. All. No, the we used to set up to like break. Homie, it. we were so ghetto. We would steal the ones from school that you just made. You put it in and push play, and it would come out. It was like a side. You know what I'm talking about? The school? You guys never had that? Nah. So so it's a cassette recorder, but it's it lays flat, and, and you push it, and it pops up. It doesn't go like this. And then you would hold it like this in class because, like, some fools couldn't read it, eh? and they were like, hey, fool. We're going to play the tape for you. Yeah. <laughs> oh, the one, oh, I know what you're talking about now. You know what I'm talking about? This is this is actually a good little clip one right there, dog. So yeah, dog. A four. Even if you had one of those, you would you just take man. it to a homie's pad and be like, "Yo, dog, these are all the songs I recorded off." You the could radio. record off those. Yeah. So remember they would put the tapes and they would put like a little ball on the top. Yeah, yeah. We know. Come that on. Time. We know that. Time. A lot of fools don't know that. This fool doesn't. Know. I don't know. Yeah. If you gave ball. him a tape, he, he wouldn't know what, know what, what to is. do with it. He'd be like, "What." He would know. Like, I don't even know how. Like, I, What are you scratching, yeah, that I'm girl's head? Oh, my chest is itching. <laughs> Let me see, folks. What happened, dog? <laughs> Damn, dog. She's getting oh, acne. She got red eyes. Hey, dog. She's so nice. hairy, bro. Hey. She's a tranny. Come on, dog. Hey, that homie that did that tattoo, you brought him to the uh, Popeye roast. Yeah, he was huh? at the roast. That's the homie. That's hey, freehand. Hey. Free when, when you're going to finish it, dog? I mean, that's not done, dude. Look at her. She needs some work oh, done, dog. I'm now the crazy that. part is he was proud because it was a rich that tattoo, and I was like, well, "That don't mean you get to drink all the beer." Right? <laughs> you no, know, because he it was wasn't a part crush. of the show drinking all the beer. I came back that full had ceviche tacos there, <laughs> three plates. I was like, "Hey, homie, Tommy, <laughs> nobody else doesn't have eating. a guest list." <laughs> Tommy was inviting everybody from his work and shit. Oh, but, no, they were there, but they, the homies were there. Like I didn't even know that they were going to be there. That was pretty cool. Why? Why are we being all nice on this, dog? What's going on? What, what What's happening, eh? Is that my butt or yours? That's Be honest. Mine. mine. Whose was it, X? The first one was mine. Nah, it's all George's weed. No, was it? Yes, yeah, it was, for, hey, for your weed Boy, lady? I my jar. Oh, no, you did not bring orange no... one? Where is it? <laughs> well, last week you brought that not orange me. jar. Nah, there's no jar around this whole house. There was a jar right here. There we go. Bam! Told Tell me, this is like a gram. It's not like George. Is it even Yo, good? Wait a minute. All I want to hear is boop. Test it out, George. It the OG? smell, dog. No OG. It's like uh, it's like buying cologne from Savoni. 
There's There's a good no time smell to that. Rate your own weed. Rate your own weed. Hey, hey. Would you give that to B-Real? Would you give it? I gave it to him. You'd give that to B-Real. That's what B-Real told me. Hold on. Can you smell it? He's like, you know why? He's like, you know why? I know this weed. This good weed. He said because I only smoked one joint the whole podcast instead of smoking like seven joints. First of all, look at the difference in the jar that I have my weed in me, and there's weed in there. Baller ass jar. Damn, where'd you get that one? Come on, is that from that fool? Nah, this is someone else. I'm saying whoever wants to show me some love. <laughs> nah, dog. Uh, right now there's this uh, high nah, dog. It's got, uh, you remember coming to America where Eddie Murphy had money, so he kept sending real expensive shit to that girl? Yeah. There's this old lady out there, dog, that like, so hey, for one so night, you stuff? Dog, one night we were all coked out, me and Eddie, and he was like, hey, fool. My other homie told me that if you go on cougar.com, he found some he found some website. Cougar.com. Yeah, A4. And we just I put pictures of me when I was like 30, dog. <laughs> <laughs> and then this one Heine, she kept hitting me up, dog, and fuck. Still. It. And hey, but the thing is, is I gave her the address to TJ Showgirls. <laughs> yeah. So you I'm can't not gonna let her know. Yeah, and sometimes the mailman takes my shit. I know, dog. <laughs> You're like, hey. Because over there they usually have to drop it off and we have to sign, but this came through. It's beautiful, dog. Yeah, that's it's bad. brand new. Okay, I just got yeah, the corks were still. You know what I'm saying clear. Yeah, that me la mando, dog. That's a good one. It's just, I mean, hey, dog, it's probably worth two hundred bucks. No, that's a good little three hundred. Yeah, but if you break it down, like it's priceless because it's, yeah, it it's glass. Fucking, you know, it's from a it stalker. It came from a from a person with a heart. From an old lady that wants fierro, dog. Yeah. What's the oldest she'll take down? Well, there's some old ladies. That you'd be like, What's the you oldest you'll take man? down, Tommy? I'm probably like 50. Because you must have. <laughs> now, you saw some at Best, at best Time Mucho. You saw some fine old see, ladies. Oh, yeah, but I, How old are you going like, Damn, then? Damn, lady, this lady's probably 60. You down for I don't know, old? fool. There's, fool, think, Sam Hayek. She's you like, can't pull Sam Hayek, though, dog. Well, if, if I met her, put me in the same. I told you, Kylie Jenner, when she was walking by, locked eyes with I me. I want to get your name. I want to get a tattoo. <laughs> yeah. I'm telling you. you will drop her with that one, dog? Cool, I'll hit her right here. Let me tell you something in your ear, and I'll just start whispering. And she'll be like, wait a minute. She'll tell her security, get him. Let's go. I'm going. I'm going. You're under, going to jail. I'm going to, You're going to jail, dog. You're going to jail. Hell What's the oldest man. for you, X? Me? I can't do past 40. Chill. Oh, okay. That's 10 years. That's 10 years. 40 is good, man. 10 years. Now, when I was 20, I took down like a 48, 49er. I'm 46 now, When dog. you were 28, you took down when a 50-year-old? When I was 20, dog, I took down a 48er down. Where? Wouldn't what me fuck? where a Foxfire player? A sick one. Hey, that's but a real But you got to remember, hey, you've seen the pictures of me. When I was young, I looked yeah. old. Yeah, so you were like, oh, already, you're, she, she thought already I thought was you were 30. 28. She was like, I shall <laughs> stop lying. Yeah, you're like, look, I, look, I was I doing, even, start, I was doing construction, homie. I had, I had two kids already. No, you know, it happened when I was 22, but I take that back, 22. Yeah, still. Like, yeah, but a full. She was bad. She was bad. You got to remember, dog, um, a, a lot of people look at an older woman in the 40s and they're like, Damn, it's kind of like my joke. Look at that 98 Honda Accord still in the guy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right? Because, like, to me, I know, when a, I know when a lady looks at me, she's like, hey, man, say, somebody took care of that act girl. <laughs> <laughs> it was in the garage. You know what I mean? Yeah. But, uh, hey, dog, now that I'm 46, I'm down for a little 65 maybe. <laughs> You're making me think. At that point, what, what type of car is Tommy? Uh, Tommy, he's a nomad. <laughs> no, no, Impala. No, nah, 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 bro. Nah, nah, dog. All right, uh, fucking. Dream of you're a van. You're a van, eh? You're a van. Sick you're right. You're a van. Chevy, you're an Astro van, like an Astro. Yeah, Chevy you're Bandura. an Astro van. <laughs> you're an Astro 1983 van. 1983 Chevy Bandura. <laughs> nah, you know what you are, dog. You remember the Astro vans? They had like the McLean. Oh, with the Danes or yeah. uh, I rocks on them. Hey, that's what you are, dog. Boom, boom. Well, yo, and everybody, they, little, they put little uh, the drapes. <laughs> Yo, everybody, we're going to take a little roll right now. We're going to get higher and see how crazier this next round gets. We'll be back. Tommy, say something, dog. Say something, dog. Give, <laughs> give, give me an outro, Tommy. And we'll be back. Nah? Come on. I want to get a <laughs>
<laughs> Hit him with the oldie? Nah, nah. Uh, that's it. Yeah. Quote him. Quote him. <laughs> that cabron. <laughs> He's going to kill me if he finds you here. <laughs> we'll be back. And we're back like a hood rat in the Cadillac waiting for the sizzag. George Press Stories is brought to you by Gunthers, located in Santana, Monte, and Santana, and Santana. They specialize in Pendletons, Ben Davis, Khakis, Wranglers, 501s, Levi, Solos, Ben Davis, Earhart. They got a van store. Like a whole section in the back. They got a whole section for Pendletons as far as the blankets, the trench coats, the camisas, the button-ups. X, what would you say about Gunther's? Uh, they're dope. George loves them. I love them. I got a couple Pendletons. Tommy's got one that he <laughs> that he got from there, the only one he got from there. But, yeah, go to Gunther's.com. We don't have a promo code, but you will look George Press style. Exactly. And if you don't live in California, go to Gunther's. Go to Gunthers.com. Go to Gunthers.com, and uh, we don't have no promo code, but like I said, you will look GPSs. Yeah. Well, what are you wearing today, dog? Me, dog, I'm wearing my LAFC scarf because we're going to win this year back-to-back. Come on. It looks like you guys got to be high to win. A little bit. A little bit. Yeah, these are the 42 Originals. There's the the little. So they made that? No. Okay. Somebody made it. So you know how there's like a tailgating for football? Yeah. Well, they also have tailgating for football. It's 420 Originals. Yeah, 420 Originals. (laughs) 42 original. Yeah. It is, yeah. fool. Yeah. Okay, go ahead. Tell the story. No, go there's ahead, a t- they have a tailgating like football does, <laughs> and there's a section of them who are obviously stoners because there's a community of stoners, and you go there, and they have a tent where you can go get high, and they got food, munchies, and they're really At cool. At the people. stadium? Not in yeah, the parking lot. Like in the parking lot. The parking okay. lot. Like and you're part of That's your audio? Uh, yeah, they're, they're the homies. They always hook up. Hook How'd they up. jump you in? Hmm? Well, you know, I know E-Zone. That's all, that's all you need. E Zone, I showed up with E Zone, and they're like, You got stone, you guys smoke. And E Zone has juice over there, dog. I seen him. Yeah. He's sitting by the band. He mm-hmm. sits by Be Real. Uh, yeah. I seen that full sit by Pele. He was on the field the other day. Yeah? E Zone got field access at yep. the game? The, the bottom. Oh, that's what's up. Good Have for you him. ever been to a soccer game? Yeah, homie, but a real one. Who? What do you mean, who, dog? Well, soccer game, would you go see Mexico, dog. USA? I went to the World Cup in 1994, Cal State Fullerton, dog. Really? Yeah. What'd you see? Who I, I seen uh that that I was when Colo- hey that that was when Colombia had Andres Perez, remember dog when the uh, the cartel killed they, when they killed Escobar yeah. yeah I was at those it was right here in Orange County they used to play at Cal State Fullerton dog we had a field pass went to I seen Ma- what's that guy Maradona Maradona yeah no and then that one goalie that had like the 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 crazy hair the, cur- yeah. the curly hair then there was that curly hair blonde guy that played. For Columbia. Uh, USA had like Kobe Jones. <laughs> so we had some whack ass players, dog. Dang. For that real, was dog. before big stadiums. Crazy, huh? No, it was always big stadiums, dog. Soccer is the most well, famous sport in the world. Well, Full- Cal State Fullerton has a crazy stadium or what? Well, it's not that. It's just like they had so many other games going on. Oh, okay. Cal State Fullerton Stadium is huge, dog. Is it? Yeah. And Orange County had to get some money because it was in Southern California. They probably hooked it up all night. Uh, now, you know what, Fool? I think they were playing. I think they were staying at Cal State Fullerton. That's how I seen them, like, at the practice field. They're, yeah, yeah, they are probably practicing there. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because I was going to say, they're not going to be. Right. But they were selling those tickets. Yeah, yeah. For sure. How was it? I think it yeah, was at the you Coliseum, could get tickets, right? The, the, like, there's at the a, Coliseum, yeah, 100% yeah. they play at the Coliseum. Training camp? Yeah. But by anyways. training camp, yeah. Yeah, homie. Uh, that's cool, dog. You know, it's it's a little loud, but it's like, what's up? <laughs> what it's, do you think? What do you mean? What do I think? I think they're gonna win. Yeah, they're gonna what do you mean? It. Yeah, they're gonna win. I think Sunday. a guy. Come on. Who, I think a guy who wears that scarf should have weed on him, papers, and a lighter. Do you have any? Right now. Right, if hey, homie, if you're wearing Bust that, it, let's blaze it. I'm not gonna lie. When I come to George Perez, I know there's weed, papers, blunts, yeah, weed. See? Tommy, don't you, you don't you're, you, have, you come here you, you, see you come here hungry you come here hungry you come here with no weed you sometimes come here with no jacket asking you I'm cold <laughs> yeah. expecting X. George to X. give you a, a fucking new penalty one. dog like, now nah, you come in here with hey, I need a penalty before I get too cold hey you come <laughs> here like immigrants come to America no money <laughs> no clothes one I just played dog what did he tell you today. Like, if my car don't start, you got to jump start me, George. Nah, he was like, hey. No, nah, hell no. My car better be good. He's After like, all that? 
Nah, Tommy was like, hey, uh, did you guys go shopping? Even my lady was like, hey, I made extra. Where's Tommy? They better, they better, There's a bowl of pozole in there for you, dog. All right. It's going. But X I'm going to heat it up right now in the next break. Hey, uh, when you go to work, does your does your uh, does your lady take care of you at lunch or she in gives the you morning, a twenty? Bro, she wakes up at three in the morning. Damn. Nah, before cooking. you, I'll be I'll be. What wakes me up <laughs> is the is the cooking. I'll be like, is that bacon? She's like, don't worry. I'll be like, all right. <laughs> she, She's like, you got fifteen yes. more. You, she got you got fifteen more. And then that's just making me breakfast so I could go. And then then she starts making lunch, dog. Damn. <sighs> <laughs> so well, all right, bad, all right. Let's see. So you're not lying. What did she make you on the spot? Don't fuck. Burritos huevo con weenie. <laughs> for lunch, though? You said I'm talking breakfast. for lunch. I'm breakfast. talking lunch. So he gets burritos. a fresh so breakfast. Take. Okay. Hey, does Tapatio ever expire? <laughs> yeah. Does the bottle? Because I got a big old bottle, and I'm like, I don't remember. If it looks like mortar oil, dog, it's, it's done. getting dark. Yeah, yeah no. but I'm like, maybe it's more hotter, more concentrated. No, it's <laughs> it's because I don't remember right buying. I'm like, when? Hey, the is last that time a, we look bought that up, a bottle? X, of does stop at the hey, and I looked at the bottle, and they don't have an expiration date. date, and I have a little bottle, and it doesn't well, have you know an expiration what? If date. The guy's like, Mexican, or he's white, right? The fool's a white fool with blue eyes, right there. Well, the if his eyes turn brown, you know it's a wrap. That's it. Hey, your blue eyes are turning brown. All right, here it is. What's the shelf life? Although Tapatio does not have four a years. definition a definition expiration date, we recommend consuming it within two years of the purchase date Damn. for optimal flavor. So Damn, that's a long last. Two years. Two years? Two years. That's that means good. it's processed like crazy. Oh, yeah. That's Ooh, all you salt. Know, that's you know all what salt, makes vinegar. me mad, dog? My girl, my mom would make hot sauce food. Like, my mom would make salsa, and I'll bring it to the house. And my, mom, and my girl would be like, hey, it's been out. And she'll throw it away one day. And I'm like, hey, it's still good. Like, Nah, it's not good no more. Nah. Salsa's good for a while. You could leave salsa. Yeah. You can't leave it unrefrigerated oh, no, for it one day. Oh, no, it has to be refrigerated. Day. Tommy will leave it, like, outside. I thought, oh, okay, then. She's right, then. I'm tripping on my girl. Yeah. Now then my I girl, remember it be now my girl be trying house. to throw the my girl be trying to throw away carne asada after two days. I'm like, what the hell? Oh, my, that you ate? my girl's known for that. My oh my god, fool! My girl thought I'll meet. We won't use it, and we'll be like, she'll be like, oh, what's up? We had to cook it. I, we thought it out. I was like, it's cool. We can use it tomorrow. The next day, she's like, it smelled weird. I was like, fuck no. That was a big ass piece of chunk did of you, meat. Did you put it back in the fridge at least? No, nah. no, 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 in the fridge. It's no, right. like I'm talking about. Like, yeah, fool, like, it'll be thought out, and I'll be like, thought out, so we could use it. And then she'll be like, oh, we'll change but our mind. you smell funny. Put she it back in the you fridge. She'll be like, hey, <laughs> shoo, get, she would, she'll throw it away. X, like, the, there's a lot does of your girl ever away. make you anything? You don't have a girl. I don't have a girl. No, I make myself all everything at the house right now. Everything? Make picadillo, tinga. No! Atun, atun. Well, you don't have a measuring cup. What the cup fuck is atun? Atun. Tuna? Tuna salad. Yeah, fool, you've never had tuna Why don't you salad? Why did you say tuna salad? Atun, dog. Because hey, I'm paisa. How do you make it, though? Break down the tuna salad. What did you have for breakfast today, dog? Like cereal? Break it down. Break it down. What you want to break down? Break down tuna salad right now. Tuna salad. All right, you go, you go, you buy the little cans of tunas. You know, I the, know you the go and buy that shit. I'm talking okay. about what the fuck you Okay, and then you go corn. Tomatoes. You know, then you go to the store, but I have corn. to take the bus because. I, <laughs> all right, all right, all right. How the fuck you make all right, that shit? Tuna, corn, uh, tomatoes, uh, purple onions, mayonesa, and mustard, and salt and pepper, and garlic, <coughs> and tostadas. And you, you yeah, you put it in the fridge to get cold, and you eat it with tostadas. Bomb. Simple. Bomb. Delicious. Healthy. That was my prison snack right there. That's dog. that's a prison snack right there. With some, with some Fritos. Ooh. And I would just crunch the bag and put the Fritos on top and get a piece of bread, chop it down the middle, homie, so I can sleep in, scoop, and then eat it. You ever eat sardines? Hell no. Yeah, hey, you? <laughs> yeah, sardines are fire. That's hey, disgusting. well, my, my dad used to eat that shit, and I'd be like, damn. <laughs> then it, he used to cut up, like, tomato, onions, and cilantro, all the bomb. And then he would mix it up and jalapenos, I think. And then he would mix it up and make it. And he would eat it like that shit was fire. I'll be like, damn, that shit. But it was a like big ass chunks of little fish. He would just chop them up all sick. That's <laughs> disgusting. People dog. love that shit. Or the little dry shrimps. Nah, I'm good. Did they you, sell you, that in prison? Sardines, that's my. That's, hell yeah. yeah. But I, dog, once you open it, it smells like, like, like in an abandoned strip club. 
Sardines hey, stink. But why do they give you shit? And then you see the little eyes? You can't bite the eye, dog. But why do they give you shit to eat? Uh, the eye is the best part. <laughs> what do you mean, why do they give you, you shit to eat? You don't want food to be the be Fucking, mm. that's the best part. Yeah, it's supposed to be real okay. good uh, for you. What were you asking me, dog, for a throw up? How do, uh, in, in jail, why do they give them food that you can cook if they don't give them stuff to cook with? Yeah, you got a, a boiling pot. You do get a boiling pot? Well, you got to buy one, or you you can make it on your own, player. Because I'm saying, like, you see ravioli and all that, and I'm like, how do they cook that? Because you're water. not supposed to cook it, no? Yeah. I mean, what do you mean you're not supposed to cook it? Like, I'm not that, but I'm saying they give you, like, a little stove or what? No, dog. You got to fight. They, it's yours to get. It's usually processed. Like you, you just got to warm one? it up. Yeah, they sell. But... You don't get nothing in a container no more. It, it's like Tommy. You definitely don't get raw chicken. Yeah. Also, they don't got canned food. No. no. Oh, okay. Because mostly be it, 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 yeah, cans, it, huh? it comes from the kitchen, or it comes from the kitchen. But uh, 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 you can make like if you want chicken. Anything. Like if you want chicken, you get a chicken in a can, right? No, you don't. Never get chicken. There's you no can't chicken buy it. at all. You can only get chicken from the kitchen. See, but I worked in the butcher shop, so I would always cook everything there. We had a skillet. Oh, and then you would take it to the room? Yeah, not a room. I'll make burritos. <laughs> a room. Yeah, I was to the dorm. Yeah, I was a dorm, a room, a studio. To the bunk. <laughs> to the cell. <laughs> hey, and there's like a whole city being in jail, huh? If you no, want to know, I, go no, find out, eh? No, because my, no, I mean, my homie's like, dick, I see. I'm not here going to be one of those fools. Uh, no, like, cause, cause every my, place is different. No, though, but, but I'm just saying, like, my homie's like, oh, he's. I remember seeing that fool. There, he's seen another homie. He's like, that fool was, he would sell CDs and shit. I'll be like, what the fuck? What do you mean? A lot like, of people, yeah. I mean, everybody sold everything now, but I wouldn't sell my CDs. That's that's my my music. Bro. No, like he would sell CDs, like he would have a grip of CDs and he would be selling CDs. Yes, and shit. whatever. It's that's a trip. Sell, you though. can sell anything, dog. But Fools it's like selling uh, the rubber bands to your t shirts. Hey, I'll, I'll do all your shirts, right? Rubber band, make the colors all good. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, would well, well, fools like be like, hey, bring me your clothes. I'll crease them up. You know, like, can you pay for, like, services? Yeah, like of course that? you can. Because fools pay for drawings. Like, hey, draw my envelope for my daughter. I don't know if you answered the first one, but, uh, <laughs> I mean, hey, dog, at the end of the day, you kind of want to do that on your own because yeah. it's representing, like, <coughs> hey, homie, this is me. I know how to get all Bonnaroo. I know how to get G'd yeah. out. And then, you know, if it was a homie that you knew or something that was kind of struggling, and he'd just be like, yo, dog, I need some faith. Let me iron that off for you. Go ahead, player. Yeah, I know you need some money. And they're gonna put their corazón in it, but and then, yeah, you know. And I mean, hey man, you go, you can look up how inmates eat on YouTube, dog. Yeah, well, you see all that shit. Um, for- I lived it different, dog. I was the lead man of the butcher shop. I was coming home with like four sandwiches, player of ground beef, roast beef, turkey, fucking big old fat sandwiches too, dog. Huh? But cheese, mayo, everything, dog, slanging them. So I, I, I had it different. I wasn't worried about it. no one wanted chicken though. You want a roast beef. Yeah. You can make burritos, everything with that. It's it's anybody can make whatever they want, dog. We made ceviche once, dog. Yeah. Yeah, but just with paste picante sauce, we added extra uh whatever we could find, dog. Somebody came up on a cucumber. So like because you gotta remember, dog, in the kitchen, there's the uh vegetable crew, and then there's rice and beans crew, and then there's like the people that work all there. It's been a while, I don't remember what it's called, vegetation, whatever, but I was in the butcher shop. So and I would trade would... fulls meat, like hey dog, I'll give you a full two pounds of meat. We need cucumbers, we need onions, we need this, we need cilantro. And they would bring meat like some big fucking Nah, for we wouldn't bring like, it, like it'd be a, an exchange time like thing. steaks. No, time. I'm talking about you worked as a butcher. And they're like, what what meat did they have for the Homie, it was in a freezer. And but it was just in a box, frozen. It was like a year expired. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but it wasn't like a leg or, or, or like a mm-hmm. thing with, with a whole bunch of pork chops. That's what you would have? Nah. I mean, yeah, it was. But I had to cut it all into portions. So they'd be like, hey, look, here's this many pounds. Cut this shit up into this so we have enough portions. And I would pull an extra pound and mark an extra pound. Yeah, and then sauce, and then that's what, that way you would be fucking able to take some hustling fucking dog sandwiches. No, you back. could never take an exchange. It, it's it's a fucking hey, you pass this there, you pass this there, boom boom. I'll take this to the dorm. I would have to shit like fools would come in and get plates of food and hey, put these tortillas down your pants right now and you just walk back. Like yeah, dog. And fools got caught. Fools got caught. 
Like, hey, what are you doing? But the best ceviche we made, out, it was Haiva. We had pepino, peppers. And then we put the fucking, uh, we had V8s, like tomato juice yeah. in there. And we put it in there, dog. And we had lemons, squeeze all the lemons in there. Mom. Oh, dog. And we had, we had Doritos and we had salted crackers, dog. And I remember homie paid corridos. He was paying corridos right there. <laughs> and, hey, dog, it was all, like, in a big cup, eh? So that, that big cup was, oh, man, my mouth is watery, dog. Yeah. Yeah, but, I mean, hey, man, I feel bad for anybody doing time right now. <clears throat> Wherever did time, we miss you, homies, and uh, we know if you're with the business, you're with the business, player. So, Tommy, uh, you sound excited about food, bro. You've never had, like, you never had a homie that's been busted, came out, and made you a spread? Be honest, though. Yeah. Hell yeah. My homie, all the, my, uh, that fool always, let's make a spread, and he, they add a whole bunch of stuff. All right. And I made it though, so, but it's nothing. Or well, they add to it. Come on, explain something. It was like soup. That food put uh, the little sausages, pickle, uh, hop, hop Cheetos. He seen a YouTube video though. No, no, no. It, he he made. How it. did he? But how did he make it? In Tupperware and in a, it, at, he. Well, we were at home. We it wasn't like <laughs> he didn't put it in a bag like like in jail. You know. That's that's how you're supposed to do it, eh? And then we the but, warm water. Hey, if you get the warm water from the get outside, you're a champ. That water, <laughs> the, the water, the the one that's just been sitting in a hose. Yeah, the the water is different, dog. That's where I I forget about it. But um, what else is cracking, doggy dog? I mean, you've been on the podcast for what four weeks in a row now? Four weeks in a row, pulling in strong since since thirty uh, episode thirty six. Episode thirty six. Are you are you gonna get mad when I tell you, hey dog, take a couple months off? <laughs> You're eight. We you. <laughs> Eddie, Eddie's got the the night back. <laughs> we gotta do an episode on Tuesday so Eddie could be here. Eddie works Tuesday night too. Damn. One well, day. And Xavier different. doesn't want to do one on Wednesday or Thursday. Can't. Right to the traffic. Can't fool busy. Damn. Oh yeah, he's busy now, dog. Oh, Come I know. on. Player. Hey, what do you What are you doing, X? What else are you doing? Willie's podcast. He's on. E Zones podcast, Sam Tripoli's merch now. We got fucking hats, beanies, dad hats. He's trying to step it up, so we got to handle that. All right. Yeah. That's what's up. That's cool. Do Tommy, when you got any merch? I got a fucking, I'm going to have my show, my art in another show. <laughs> Oh wait, wait, wait! Yeah, didn't you do an art show? How'd I that did go? An art show in San Diego. How'd that go? Yeah, you couldn't go. He still show. has everything. It was, a, it was yeah. a group show. Did you sell any art? Yeah, I'm selling a napkin. Man. It it was a a group show. What the? It what was, did I you sell, dog? Homies. So how much? Twenty Just bucks. The paintings. Two hundred. Yeah. Two hundred. And and this uh, weekend or no on the sixteenth December sixteenth at the second floor in Huntington Beach, they're having a tattoo heritage fundraiser. They're gonna open up like a tattoo museum. In are, they gonna, are they gonna do tattoo nightmare and fix all your stuff? And they're <laughs> tattoo nightmares, <laughs> and they're and they're gonna have art show, and people could go to this art show and buy art for two hundred dollars. Every piece of there is only two hundred bucks. So if you want, oh buy wow, it, and, and all that money goes towards the tattoo heritage project. Which is a, a museum they're gonna open in Long Beach. So is your art gonna be there? Is what yeah, you're I'm gonna have. Well, I'm gonna have one piece I, that I donated to it. Who makes more money, tattooers or barbers? Tattooers. Okay. Tattooers for sure. Well, I'm um, the X. Depends on the barber. It depends on the barber, but yeah, on on a normal you, 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 on a normal shit like at a regular barber. I and think a regular you're getting tattoo more. Shop, you're getting shop. more haircuts than you're getting tattoos. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but you think a uh, tattoo is gonna cost two thousand bucks, eight hundred bucks, three hundred dollars? It'll be two thousand bucks. And those a does day. anybody have? A, does anybody me. do people do artists have personal tattoo artists like they have personal barbers? Yeah, that's a good question. No, huh? they don't. Hey, no, hey, this yeah. is a good question. Yes, they do. And hey, I'm not dissing tattooers because tattooers, like like my one of my favorite is Big Sleeps Roman from Yukaipa, uh, yeah. the guy that doesn't do yours. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> no, but I'm saying that there's fools that only go to these people. That's yeah, their, that that's their shit. Is like they pick that. My homeboy rascal art, yeah. like they make loot. Uh, they're all those fools make 
bank. The food of Mr. Cartoon. Oh, yeah, Mr. Cartoon. He still it. tattoos? Yeah, he still tattoos. I thought tattoos he does, like, bigger things. At, yeah, he he does everything, but he still tattoos. I heard he tattooed Obama. He tattooed 50 Cent's back, oh, like, in one video. day. Yeah. That shit probably cost $60,000. For reals, huh? Or more. Yeah, For sure. Nah. He's like, oh, let me get this one. Yeah, I don't think anybody's making more. I don't think any barber's making more than Cartoon. But yeah, you know what I'm saying? Maybe that fool, uh, who is it, Rob the Original? I feel they'd be doing like professional like a, athletes a, a and all that. Portrait of, of Tupac on the fool's back of the head. I don't know, I don't know this. And whoever, don't get mad at me, but uh, Kat Von D made some good money. Yeah, well, yeah Kat Von D made some good money. She's a one great point. tattooer. Yeah, yeah she's one, one of the best yeah, she just portraits. Went away from that. She just said, stop getting tattooed. Yeah, she's a Christian now. Uh, oh yeah, yeah. That's cool. Good. Yeah, yeah, good for her. Yeah. Man. She looks happy, dog. Hey, oh, they yeah. better not be lying though, dog. Because a lot of fools be trying to be like, "Oh yeah, we changed our religion and all this," and then it's, like, hey, no, man, it's religion. Look at Snoop. I know, but look, dog. I'm not backing religion up, but religion is not for you to be perfect. It's for you when you do make a mistake, you're trying to go the better path of it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Like, I know you're not religious. I'm religious big time. What are you? Catholic. When's the last time you went to church? When's the last time you confessed yourself? You just said you're 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 Catholic. When's the last? I'm time? Catholic, but I don't. He's, he's never even been in confession. Going, he's like confessed and should never been. To he's like I'm not a usher. <laughs> yeah, I told you I'm not baptized, Dick. <laughs> you're, you're not, not Catholic. You're Catholic. That's the okay, number one I rule. I practice Catholic religion. <laughs> <man>. <laughs> pra- this isn't soccer. What do you hey, mean? Hold you practice. on. Hold it's on. Not hold football. on. Hey, have hey, faith. Hold on. Look, I practice basketball. Does that mean I'm on the Lakers? No, but you're a basketball player. But they didn't baptize me. I've so I'm not baptized. in. You don't have a locker. No, but I just, I'm in, you know, I believe it. Okay, okay, here it is. Have you taken your kids to church? Have they been into church? No. Come on, bro. You can't call yourself I Catholic. I to A4, like, when you, when you go to church, do you, like, you're only supposed to go get the bread and wine if you've done cafe. You don't care. Yeah, no, nah, I never went. I me always neither. wanted to go. Hey, 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 I, hey, I always I'm go like, get it. My brother's what like, what are you, are you doing? I'm, I'm like, I'm going to get mine. I've got it. I gave five bucks, homie. I need to get mine. You do the, yeah. Something. You do. You, you thought that's what the five bucks were for? Yeah. For, for the fucking <laughs> snack? I was like, hey. <laughs> okay. they, they passed the bucket I around. Get it. I, just I noticed see what everybody it's like. that put money in the basket went up and got some. They said it's like a wafer. And then A4, this is the crazy part. Like, they make you wait and do like a prayer, and they're all watching me, and I'm just looking at everybody. <laughs> and then they get up for and the guy looks at you, and he's like, I know this Lotto hasn't come here, eh? <laughs> yeah. I look tore up like this right here, dog. <laughs> and then I'll get this fool out of here. Yeah. Who brought him? I remember I used, I used to, to go, go tore up. Well, I used to go to over. church just for the, they used to have uh, buñuelos. My aunt used to take us to church. Those are bomb. And they used to, have, they used to sell buñuelos on the side and, and churros and all that. And, not, and hot uh, champurrado. And oh. that's what I was like, that was, I would look forward to going because we'll be like, oh, we're going to be a fat problem. kid your whole life home. Huh? Yes. So I used to embarrass my mom in church. I feel yes. bad, dog. But fool, I've been I okay, I've been a fat fool my whole life. But I've been this size since fucking tenth grade. Okay. Like I fool in my pants size. If there's fools, I'm like, damn, this fool blew up. And uh, that fool was a skinny fool in high school. I'll be like, look at this fool. Big as hell. And me, I'm like, I'm the same size fool. You can look at pictures of me back in the day. I'll be like, I still wear the same pants from Two thousand three. I'm like these right here. Hey, if I trip out on pants that I have, I'm like, hey, I'll look at. He always like, avoids I that. Hey, I'm telling you. How long you have those shorts for, though? For real. I have a. What, the, the shorts you pissed on. Yeah, yeah, the shorts you pissed on. The yellow shorts. No, no, supposedly. Those are my favorite fucking shorts. Don't wonder. Don't yeah, know you... what fucking happened to them? If I find those motherfuckers, I'm going to fucking wear them to the fucking yeah, podcast. Yeah, your girl threw them out because hey. they smell like piss. Hey, so, X. So, so, can, yeah, so can we go back to me embarrassing my mom at yeah, church? Yeah, church, sure, yeah. <laughs> um, you know, we just veered off. Nah, hey, homie, like, uh, my mom was kind of like trying to be in the, like, she knew gente in there that was part of the church. Yeah. And she, my dad, my, my dad had money, dog, and my mom would be like, "Hey, I need to give them a hundred bucks every time we go." And I'd be, like, we'd be flipping out, like, "What? You're just four hundred a month, eh? yeah?" But they let us sit closer. You know what yeah. I mean? And hey, homie, I used to go to Saint Callista's Church. It was on Garden Grove Boulevard, and I was right by my baby's mom's house. And uh, yo, dog, how old were you when you stopped going to church? Oh man, I I didn't. I wouldn't. My mom would be like, "Why are you dressed like that here?" I would 
Crease down 501's dog. Yeah. Like I thought I was going to Shade a dance, dead. homie. Like hey, Walt? Like like yeah. And like during church, like looking at like, looking at hey, I don't like, know. Say, yeah. You know I mean, trying to bust a joke in when the pastor. <laughs> because, <laughs> you know, the pastor or the priest, right? It's a pastor, right? They always come with like a little funny thing and I would throw a little extra. <laughs> you know, he's like, and then he'd be like, Mira, yo, I see people in here that are dressed like gangsters. That you can tell have done bad things yesterday, but people. <laughs> You're the only one there? No, for everyone. Even my mom's just like, Dad, he can't wait. <laughs> And then he, but hey, for he made me feel good, dog. I gave twenty bucks that day. Yeah. Did you have a nice church? Like, did you guys go to a nice church? It was like a nice was ghetto. Man. No, was it, ghetto. it wasn't nice, but it wasn't ghetto. Hey, it's they bought the Crystal Cathedral. Okay, that's not ghetto. Yeah, that's no, but there. it was on the corner. Of, they, like they got rid of that hey, one. Crystal Cathedral, tie on. Huh? Yeah, but they got rid of that one and bought the Crystal Cathedral. Well, let, let me get to the story, dog. So the pastor's up there, and he's like, you know, and this was trying to get me to go up there. And he's like, Ira. God will forgive you guys for carrying guns, <laughs> for doing drugs, for trying to hurt people. Yeah. And he was like, fellas, God's talking to me right now. I need someone to come. And my mom was like, bent then. I was just like, fuck nah. no, dog. Put, fucking grab 20. He was saying this during the, the basket passing, dog, like to try to get more people. And that fool looked at me, dog, and I showed him a 20 and put it in. He was just like, he stopped talking about it. <laughs> He's like, all right, now, after this, <laughs> yeah. on next Sunday, we're going to have this type of yeah, class. And nah, but he was just like, you want to meet God, huh? And I was like, hey, you know, I talked to him once in a while. I never met him personally. Yeah. Like, I was still the funny smartass. He's like, what's stopping you from meeting God? Is it your friends? Bring your friends. And I was like, man, my <laughs> Friends don't live by here, eh? <laughs> they can't, we can't be right here. That's either. crazy, dog, how, like, pastors... Man, if I offend you, I offend you. Let's, be re let's, let's look at the reality of a pastor. His job is like anybody else's job. And what's that? To put money, to put food on the table and pay for the pad that he has his family in. Yeah. And he thinks that God... It's like, I want you to speak to these people, and they're going to give you fed, yeah. Am I right, X? Yep. Is 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 that like the... the hey, do pastors the preach, like, the do they get paid? Man, madness. No, but uh, like... They like don't, the, look, look, Tommy. Tommy. Those who get paid? Tommy, they don't have to pay taxes. Because they don't leave the church. And the rent, they don't, have, they don't have to pay taxes. And they can write off everything. Not even write off, just be like, hey, that's the church's But they bus. get a paycheck? That's the church's car. That's the church's... Everything. everything. No, like the priest, he gets a check. Yes. He, Every month. He reports what he wants to report. He's getting cash as one of those gift baskets and all that shit. He gets that. Do you think the government knows how much how much you gave? You think the government knows Tommy gives a hundred bucks no, every no, day I'm in a church? About, yeah, like, so what that, would you say a church makes a week, a Sunday? Damn, I see. It depends because those mega churches. Have you heard of the mega churches? Yeah. Oh, oh, that's he, a great huh? church. On Easter, okay. they make like one two point three million, yeah. right? Two You're or three million. Talking, those are the like huge shirts. They got a channel oh player. God. And you think that no one knows how much you gave. And hey, so the they Chris just Cathedral, they got a camel. They had horse dog. They brought real animals for the for the uh, birth of Jesus oh, show. I mean, what, Jesus, what would your church God. be playing? Hey, they're gonna have one? Uh, Jesus thing at the cathedral? Nah, I'll I don't go. go to those no more, dog. When I, I was little, I when I was little, the Christian Cathedral, this is how they got us, dog. They, My brother got married. They had a Christian youth cathedral. group and they had a club. Only only 16 and under, dog. And they were like, I talked about this before, but like, it's it's like uh, the Righteous Gemstones, dog. Mm -hmm. They had a youth group leader. It's a family. It's a hustle, homie, but it is what it is. Yeah. They're preaching the word of God. Okay. They're getting paid. I have a feeling your mom had that, a really nice um thing where Jesus is born. And she pulled out during Christmas. Homie, she what had. What is that called? I forget the, what it's the called. Fucking, the el nativity. nacimiento, el nacimiento de Cristo. Nativity. Homie, your mom had. I have. A she had a piece. Of, she had a piece of hay from under. Her <laughs> <laughs> she had a. Remember they put him right there by the cow. Yeah, yeah, the by, by, yeah, 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 yeah. She had a piece of hay. She had one of the, hey, the you know four kings. She had one of the scarves like that. You know when they do posadas? No, nah, what's that? You know when they do posadas when they sing? Yeah, when they sing around. Yeah, yeah. And then at the night, they leave the. Baby, the little Nino of the old side of house, they did that to us when we were, when I was little. They left you. They left it at our house. And you said, "Is it a real baby?" And then in the morning, some somebody came and picked it up in the morning. 
It's like, I don't know. That's the thing they do. They leave it at a house at, in the night. <laughs> it's a, that's the whole thing about the posadas. And it's, it's weird little. They, they left. I remember fools were drinking, walking on the street, drinking beers and singing. And they shit. left the like, baby. Hey. They left the baby. Yeah. No, no, not left it on purpose. It, fool, they Tommy leave it on know. purpose. Like, like it. At the end of the night of the posada, <laughs> they leave it. The baby, the little niño dios, they leave it at a house, and that was my house that year. Okay, let's break it down. Out of, out of all the miracles that the Bible says God or Jesus did, which one is too hard for you to believe? Chill. What do you think? Which one? There's Noah's Ark. Um, There's Noah's Ark. Uh-huh. That's not one of There's miracles. Adam and Eve. Yeah, it yeah, is. It it is. is. It's, yeah, it it's is. one of the stories. He's, he's talking about one of the stories. There's okay. the Noah's Ark, Adam and Eve. There's uh, Goliath and uh, Goliath and David and Goliath. The Tower of Babylon. The Tower of Babylon. You know what that is, right? Where people wanted to go to heaven, so all the cultures got together, and they started building like a stairway up to heaven. And then they got so close to heaven that God struck it down. And then they all started speaking a different language, so they couldn't talk again. <laughs> no way. Yeah, there's the. There's a lot and more. T- he didn't let them get in. Yeah. But that's a dog. Oh, you believe let that? Him get Can in. you believe that? All right. There's a lot more. He turned water into wine. Oh, yeah. He walked over water. Or and he cured the blind. He cured the blind. Now, he, they, they parted the Red Sea. That that was Moses. Player. That was Moses. But that's part of the. the, the but that's, that's Moses. You, that's a different testament, dog. Right. Don't mess with them, homie. Oh, oh yeah. That's pretty, that's pretty dope, though. That's pretty no, badass. Maybe, though. May, I think maybe, like, did with the blind fool. He spit on the ground and he got the mud and put it on the fool's eyes and then he could see. I don't. I don't that know. sounds like a rich guy story. That sounds like a little something way off. You that you can't buy that one. I don't know. I want to. Like it's kind of cold. I, I, it huh? happened. It happened. I have faith that it did happen. But I'm just saying that's kind of hard. Can I, can I, and so is the tower probably can and I say the though? water into wine. Can I? Can I say something? How does a perfect person not make a perfect human? Exactly. Like if you're perfect, there should be no flaws. There should be no one should have teeth like you. Nobody should have. But he doesn't want anybody. He doesn't want anybody to be perfect. That's not the point. If everybody's perfect, that's not the point. How does a perfect? How does something that say, "Oh Jesus, God's perfect. He does no wrongs." Well, he he made X. Well, look at Xavier. here. Like. We're hey, there's a scientist that says that. What's that scientist for? They say a lot of things. They also no, say no, the no, Big no, Bang is true. No, the 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 Degrassi guy. Yeah, Degrassi, not Neil deGrasse Tyson. Yeah, he also says that the he says a lot of things. He's also told no, you to take the vaccine. No, but I'm saying that's kind of like accurate. Like, hey, he says to take the vaccine. Yeah, he said take the vaccine. Come on, well, he getting paid. Nah, he, he, <laughs> hey, oh, I don't believe X. <laughs> I don't believe in X on now. But hey, <laughs> and then come on, dog, being pregnant without. Oh, yeah, the, the, I can't believe that. Eh? Well, a hey. Virgin Mary. I can't believe that one. What about G- what about Jesus uh, coming back to life? Come on, don't, don't believe I, that one either. How did he come back I to believe, life and hasn't come back since? It. You mean this fool for come back for being for, dead? He died for our sins. No, no. See, the, he, but how come he hasn't come back? No, he rose because he rose up to heaven. Yeah, he's good. He's in heaven. What he, do you mean? He's he's yeah. He rose. He came back. And so he's never coming heaven. back again. He's supposed to come back. It's been 2,000 years, player. You died and came back like an hour later. No. And now, like, what's taking so long? He's supposed to come back down it's on not Earth. the time. You guys are really believing this shit? It's not the time. I believe in Jesus. And before Jesus was how many years? Before he was even put out, what, 200,000 or what? How many years do you think the Earth has been here before Jesus was? Ooh. Depends what timeline you believe. Do you believe in what you know, I'm not asking you what said? timeline I believe. I'm asking you. When, how old do you think Earth is before Jesus? Oh, it's a long ass time. Millions of millions, hundreds oh, yeah. of millions Tommy, of years. Tommy believes in dinosaurs. Think so of dinosaurs. Okay, 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 okay. So you, <laughs> you say, don't believe in dinosaurs? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Real, no, hey, dude. hey, hey, there has to be a structure right here. You said two million years. Uh, 600 million years. Okay, 600 million years, <laughs> Earth was here before Jesus. What do you say? 10,000 before Jesus. 10,000 years? Yeah, the It's already been stuff. fucking 20,000 B- AD, dumbass. No, it's not. It's 2,000. It's 2,000 B- uh, A-, A... It's 2,000. It? There's 2,000. He was born in the year AD, zero. 2000 in 2024. AD. 2,000 yeah, AD. Yeah, AD before, before Jesus, before after Jesus Christ. Death. BC. BC, after death, yes. 
So it's been 2,000 before years. It's been 2000. What about before Christ? That's what I said. Before Christ, another eight. <laughs> Maybe oh another ten. God. Okay, so. For sure not six million years. Okay, so well, you I don't, don't know. I mean, he, I he wasn't in here during. How, how old are the uh, Egyptian uh, pyramids? They say like 4,000 years old. 4,000. Way more than that. Let me see. He wasn't here for that either. He wasn't here for the... 40,000. 40 years. And 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 what did Xavier say? He died for us, for our sins? Yeah. Yep. 45,000. Exactly. 4,500 years ago. The money, what? man. I was right. What'd you say? 4,000 years ago. That's all off. How old are the pyramids? That's all off. <laughs> he went to one and of those... I don't those... even believe that. Okay, yeah, yeah. You don't believe so... the Egyptians? King Tut and all that? Okay, hold on. Let me Let me get you guys to the structure part of it. So what I'm trying to say is you both believe in aliens, right or wrong? No. Hold on. X, you're I, I, I hold believe on. in flying. Uh, those flying saucers are U.S. intelligence. Do you believe in aliens? No. Another species outside of this world? No. Do you believe in another species, extraterrestrial aliens? Yeah, but that's not what the government's showing us. That's Those aren't aliens. Okay, no, no, but do you believe in them? Yeah, there's something else. Like, Jesus could be an alien. Why would an alien Why die for human sins? That, dog, too, I don't know. Okay, okay, stop, 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 stop. Not could be. Do you believe Jesus was an alien? No, right? You believe he was a god. God would be an alien to me, though. No, no, but what, is, God, what is your if, definition of an alien, then? Uh, Something that isn't human, that has supernatural powers, like Jesus. Just because he does. A shark he, is not human and has supernatural powers? Not su- that's not super. What, it can eat someone? That's not a supernatural powers. It, having a strong jaw is not a supernatural powers. That's just Have nature. you seen a shark? Yeah, it's not supernatural. Have you ever seen Jesus? I've seen a... Uh, no, 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 no. I haven't seen Jesus. Okay. Damn. So, but he, according to everybody, has superpowers. So he could be an alien in my eyes. And my eyes is something that's not human. So and, if you have su- and if you have superpowers, you're not human. Okay, so how can Jesus be an alien? But they made angels first, and the angels were in the made in the form of them. Human. Aliens, could correct? Be, angels could be aliens too. No, it's not. Could be. We're we're speaking facts. We don't know this. You can't can't tell you about facts. I don't know. No, I'm no just one telling knows. you this. The man who took pictures of the UFOs, he has like a. This crazy scope. The guy in Ridgecrest? He took a picture <laughs> of the <laughs> UFO. And you zoom when you zoom in, it, it, you, it's you can see the dude. It's a it's a human. It's a guy like in a in a in a spacesuit. It's like all a, front. Like dog. an astronaut. And it, it's there's a, no it's such a UFO. thing as Jesus dog. There's no such thing as aliens. No, yeah, there's there's no no there's not. you just try to he just tried to say Jesus was an alien. I have faith because it's been so aliens me. Are making us believe that somebody died for like hold on. Like, George what do you has mean? no faith. No faith. What do you mean no faith? No faith. I right? got reality. I got I got more creativity than you guys. Tommy, you have Are faith? you guys kidding? Like I have faith. <laughs> yeah, but faith. No faith. Like about, Jesus. You from, don't believe in God then. Doc, no, we didn't hear about him and, until Rome. <laughs> until Rome ran. There was no God. <clears throat> like, do you remember do you remember the first thing every race believed in? What's the first thing every race believed in? The sun. Exactly. Yeah. Did the sun show up every day? Yes. And what happens if the sun isn't there? We're done. Is there profit in worshiping the sun? Yeah. No. There's no profit. You don't the, you don't you don't got to go to the sun and be like, "Hey, homie, can you baptize my kid for me today?" Do a little like one of those things you made up. It's it's all up. It's another business. They get paid for weddings. They get paid for baptisms. They get paid for services. It's, it's you're going somewhere to get entertained to make you feel like ah. Oh, but you don't have to. Go, you word. don't have to go to church to believe in Jesus or believe in God. And then it ain't real. Yeah, it is. How you don't have to go to church. How do you get the Bible? You can read your Bible at the house. How do you, do you get the, how, read, how do you, you get it at the store? And they're free a lot of the time, actually. Bibles are free. Yeah? Yeah. So you, people just read it and, and stay and, and lock themselves in the house? Why aren't you going to church if you're... You can. A lot of people are very spiritual, and they don't have to go to church every day. Do you believe in God or an alien or an alien God? You I, can't have both. Yes, I can. Who, I, who, who are you to tell me I can't believe in because neither one Because you're contradicting yourself. 
No, God I died don't know. for humans. That's what the book says. You're saying I believe yeah. in the book, and I also believe in aliens. Yeah, right or but wrong? I'm telling you, you're t- you're asking no, me. No, I don't believe in aliens. I, I'm no, I'm telling you what Xavier said. Xavier is just trying to back up his point because he has to do another podcast, and he's like, no, "Fuck, I don't George have got me." No, you don't. George have anything. just got me. You don't have anything. I do. You're, no, you you're trying to tell me that God. No, you don't know anything. You're is an alien. With, you're, I don't know either. The thing is, I've never said it is. I said I don't know. He could be an alien. If you're telling me, how could he could be something you me, don't believe in? You told me you didn't believe in Tommy, aliens. Tommy, if I tell you, Tommy, did he say he didn't I believe in you, aliens? If I tell you, Jesus has superpowers. He can create all these things that we know. Would you consider that a human or like an alien type of human alien hybrid? That's no. <laughs> you said, okay, then what? Human, I wouldn't be like, oh, okay, that's then what? Alien shit. Then, then I'd just be like, that's some. Um, that's what. A huge, a, a, a what? A superhero? Batman? Can superhero? Hey, Superman? How can you define an alien if you've never seen one? How can you it's define something that a, isn't human? That's that. That's an alien. It's another intelligent but human being. But you've never seen or done anything of what an alien can do. So how do you know? That's that's why I said if Jesus, it's faith, right? Because you had never seen what God no, has faith. done either. Hmm? So you have faith in aliens. I have faith in that there's a God and there's some there's a higher power. I don't think that we're just some random ass thing in the earth that when we die we just disappear. If that's what you want to believe and that makes you cool, then that's what's up. I'm not, I'm not trying to be cool. I, I'm, well, I'm then, cool without this. All right, well then that's fine. I'm just trying to tell you like how you are have you no gonna faith. Say, like tell me, tell us if I have no faith. Also, no, it's not that I don't have faith. Is I have pure facts. Yeah. What are what are facts? Hey, my facts is is that Jesus died for humans. That's in a book. because you're the race that worships him. Yeah. If he if he's an alien, he yeah it wouldn't be for that. It wouldn't be like that. It would be he would die for the aliens because what God created man. That's what that's it says. Fine. Yeah. Well, then maybe he's not an alien, but he has superpowers, and to me, that's an alien. I might be contradicting myself. Homie, but... superpowers to do all Earth. And all that. Well, if you tell me Jesus can turn water into wine and walk on and walk, if I saw if I saw a human being right now (parentheses human being) walking on water. And creating water into wine and making people blind, I'd be like, bro, that's who's an alien. seen this. It's in the Bible. Yeah, but the Bible's written by no one that ever seen it or witnessed they it. Have. The stories it's, that were told. No, that's what it's, it says. It's been passed down. Someone did see it. So it's a story that that, that they heard. They said, and how many Bibles? It's been changed know. You know, because it's crazy, of though, it, it fucking it pretty much runs the world. That Bible runs the world. <laughs> It runs the presidency. No, it yeah, runs. It does. No, it, do, it doesn't run yeah, the Middle East. You, it doesn't run. It, no, pretty much the world. Yeah. It doesn't run Are we China. Not bombing them? Is Israel not bombing the fuck out of them? But Israel does not believe in the Bible. Yeah, but it has to do with the Bible. It, it no, has, it doesn't. It, not the full on Bible, but it does have to do with Jesus, Moses. No, it doesn't. They think that. Jesus was like an activist. Normal, they yeah, killed normal, him. Per, yeah, a normal person. No, they thought of him as someone that was like, no, the, you guys are wrong. It's it, This is it. They don't. The Jews. You've seen the videos, though. They're spitting on those Christian fools. Over there? Yeah, no, they, they do don't that. like that. They, well, they say all Christians or whatever. Guys, welcome to Tinfoil uh, Burrito Podcast. <laughs> 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 tinfoil teeth. <laughs> <laughs> the silver teeth. <laughs> this is Tinfoil Teeth. This is Tinfoil Fate. And that's Tinfoil Alien over there. Uh, X, I got you. I set you up for that. No, dog. you set me up. Because Evans burned me with what I was doing. You and Evans burned me. So, I, so Evans doesn't think he's an alien. No, Evans is just like Evans is like God is like junior varsity for you dumbasses. <laughs> Shit, dog. Side the caddy right there showing us his teeth. <laughs> he believes in that uh, Anuk. What's his name? Or the the first one that they all got rid uh, of? The Anunnaki. Yeah. And that's scarier because that story is exactly right. Like, yeah, they're saying that they changed our DNA. And they made us work for gold. Yeah, the G- the Z guys movie and a hey, little bit. Hey, check this out. Who's always giving you commercials? Hey, come trade your gold in the government. Yep. So why? That's pretty crazy, dog. That's it? true. You know, the, gold, the Federal Reserve. And and they just uh, well. What did they steal from Egypt? That, what did they steal from Mexico? What the, what are they steal from everywhere? Gold. Gold right now is at its highest it's ever been ever. It raised by fifty dollars an ounce. Hey, you overnight. know how many people turn this podcast off because we went all conspiracy right now? I know fools are like, hey, fuck that. But yeah, but gold did <laughs> yeah. go up fifty dollars an ounce overnight. I burned next dog. And I right got now, him. I got it. They, they're gonna. It, it's uh, the I mean, Federal Reserve is to gonna the people. start. Low in equity. Tommy? 
Oh no, no, never mind. He's not lying to people. <laughs> Tommy's not lying to people. My bad, I'm people. Serious. Tommy's being for real. Start. Gold is gold is start. gold is tough right now. Yeah, yeah. Gold is high right now. This Damn, I have a lot, gold. dog. I have yeah, a lot. It's the it's expensive right now. Really expensive. Do you have gold, Tommy? No. Nah. You don't got no gold. I have a, bo- a bar of gold, a gold chunk of a bar of gold. Like like a little M and M size or like no. like if it say it's a Hershey's bar. It's like this Like big. two lines? It's like that big. Okay, that looks like something. Show me. <laughs> now, what are you going to do with it? Just probably make a fucking sick ass medallion. A bell buckle. Bell buckle. Or. you going to make Xavier an alien god? Bell I'm buckle. Make him a t- little fucking gold <laughs> foil. Said, hat. How do you know God's not an alien? <laughs> Come on, Xavier. I don't know. We don't know. No one knows. Fool, God is not an alien, dog. <laughs> George doesn't even believe. What of God? Okay, well, we said Jesus or God, first of all. Jesus well, Jesus our... is God. He's the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. That's what your religion's telling. I'm just going off what your religion is saying, dog. Catholicism. He's the Son, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Lord, Santo, Holy Spirit, right? I don't know. This is just confusing. Too many books. Like when I was in prison, I read a dog. I, I, I mean, I read a, a book, a conspiracy book in prison. It's called The Biggest Secret by David Eckstein. Have you heard of that guy? No. And he was talking about the lizard people. He was talking about how, like the internet controls and, the, and like the masonaries and all that bullshit. And yeah. like a lot of people were telling me, yo, all that shit is made up. And I was just kind of like, it's kind of a, a difference. A, maybe... Ex- Xavier, we're all searching for answers, you know? Yeah. Right, X? You should be. Well, on that movie, of those movies, they show one part where I'm like, ah, it kind of threw me off, was they show something where they talk about weather manipulation and where these people make clouds and shit. Yeah, they do. But the videos that they show, my uncle was in the military, and he's, he, I was showing him these videos, and he's like, you guys, what are you watching? Watching, and then he was watching it with us, and he's like, trip out on this. And then they were showing these videos of, whoa, oh, there's where they make clouds. He's like, dude, this is those things where they show the videos of them making clouds. He's all, those are the videos for training when you're working, to, you know, like on when they do the the rockets, they go up in space, like the spaceships, uh-huh. the shuttles and all that. You know, when, when they throw all that smoke, he's all, well, they, those are uh, like, they, they have to test what like how much combustion and how much power that takes and force that that produces and they test and test and test and it make of course it makes huge clouds he's all, but it doesn't make clouds he's on and, and they're making it like to seem like they make these clouds he's all those are training videos that anybody in the military that did that they seen these videos a lot of times and they're like then they're trying to make people think that oh they're making clouds and he's like it's not true that's one part of the video. Maybe other parts, yeah, but that part, weather manipulation, is not real. Anybody have a question? Anybody out there have a yeah. question? Raise <laughs> your hands up, please. Hey, hey, I, I got a good question. Or uh, yeah, so X, do you believe that the um, government's making clouds for weather? Yeah. Fucking, okay. Um, then how come there's droughts? Because they want there to be droughts. They, they want, want there to yeah, be droughts. Those, so those fires, yeah, the, the Maui fires. They want to burn. Yeah, they burned down Maui. What, you, what the? They ain't no drought in Maui. They ain't no there was Maui. A drought. Wowie, that shit man. fucking blew up. This shit, they burned down. That, they burned yeah, but all they, of Maui. They, but they wouldn't. They uh, stuff. That was a laser. And that wasn't. That was a laser. We do like, have lasers. That drought, that's a weapon. Drought, that wasn't water though. If something's dry, they hey, can't do hey, anything. Hey, we're getting him today, dog. No, I'm, I'm surprised that you fool. believe in DWs. No, there is They're a laser. Direct, direct energy weapons. Yeah, no, there yeah. is a laser. Yeah, that's yeah. true. Oh, that's the been laser proven. ones, yeah, because you could even see videos. That's that. why Russia doesn't come too close. That's why China's like, hey. Like a bomb, you think, like, I think it, that's for bombs too. Oh, yeah. Like if a bomb's coming, it just. Well, they have <laughs> missiles that are. They'll launch them right here, and they'll land anywhere, anywhere in the world. You want That's it. what they say too. Bro. Shut up, Tommy. That's what they really? say. That's what they say. Tommy, shut That's your ass up. Bro. Fool, I grew up right there with all these fools. The military fucking. Why didn't you join the military then? Why didn't you join the military then? Because because of hey, that. all the fool. Hey, hey, growing up, up, growing up with military kids and and those fools, you would see you would go to their house and see their parents and shit, and they're fucking weird. Everyone, all of them. 
like as cool as you want to, them to be, it's like they were kind of fucking brainwashed, weird people, like the military people. As bad as it seems, I, I mean, have cousins. If, if they're fighting for my, my freedom, cousins, but their whole they're not weird. Shout out military. to all the veterans. Shout out to all the veterans yeah, out Tommy. there. If you're fighting for my freedom and oh, no, you no, like no, to no, shoot yeah. shit and that, that's your thing. Dog. These are all words from I'm holding about, it down podcast. Like, you're over here. Well, yeah, you're no, over no, here. No, 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 hold on, hold on. Let me hear me help you, dog. No, no, bad. I'm not saying. I'm just saying. Are you they're saying, kind of like they were always because was was Rich Crest? Let me talk, dog. Was Ridge Crest a testing area for weapons? Are you, is that what yeah, you're trying to it, tell it's me? Yeah, it's a it's so a base. They, so they had like a chemical reaction that made them. No, 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 because they wouldn't reach us. But I'm talking about. It the, looks like it did. Ki- where <laughs> they lived, where we went to school, all the kids around our school went to school. They lived on that base, and when we would go and hang out with them at their house and shit, they were a lot different than normal. How the fuck did you go to the house if they they were on the base? So you went on the base. Yeah, our school was on the base. Every morning we would have to cross the base and get onto the base. Did they search you, pat you down and shit? No. Like if our parents had to go onto the campus, yeah, they would. Unless you have like a little pass on your door that uh, eventually you would get it. But say you just were going to visit. Like the high school was there? You have to go in and get a. They would check your background, everything. But if the high school was there too? No, just the just the junior high and oh, okay. and uh, and uh, elementary. I was like, man, you were bringing weed so into man, the military. We're smoking some conspiracy weed today, though. Yeah, what is bro. this, Eddie Bravo? Oh, Eddie Bravo OG. This Deep. is Eddie Bravo OG right yeah. here. Dog. Yo, shout out to Eddie Bravo, dog, That's representing bro. Orange County Raza right there, dog. He's the OG. OG, OG, dog. Everyone loves that phone. He'll tap you out quick, Tommy. S- quick, Tommy. He'll leg lock. Hey, leg that lock, was dog. big, huh? Lock. No, yeah. nah, nah. He's, he just seems like he's a big fool. I'll kick you. I'll take you down, homie. He'll rip your neck out. Yeah. Bro. I'll 10th planet. That right? <laughs> Get yeah, that dude. fool in a lock. Real homie, quick. he is 10th planet. <laughs> that is t- that is yeah, it's the founder. You'll tip hey, I seen a sick ass. If you want to see Eddie Bravo get busy, get the video where he fights the Gracie brother. The first oh, yeah. one. I've already said this a thousand times on the, the podcast. The sickest. So. The ending in front of me? where that fool's foot is right here. And that fool's like, I'm going to snap it, dog. And he's like, snap it. He, but he didn't. He took it easy on him. And he, they, he's bad, dog. The that best. was one of the cool ones. And that's the only fight that I'll watch the whole fight is that one. Because I will try to watch other jujitsu movies. No, nah. X. Well, we've had him on the podcast go over there in the back, in the catalog. Uh, do you remember what episode? Probably like 100 episodes back, huh? Uh-huh. He did it. It was cool. He went down the rabbit hole. You guys don't know. He was like, a, he used to work at a strip club. Trust me. Go check out the episode. Yeah. Hell yeah. Eddie Bob. Well, hey, doggy dog. It's late, player. We had a good time. We had a good run, and I'm kind of mad at myself, man. I got yeah. so many comedy dates coming up. I didn't talk about it on this podcast. Everybody, I need everybody to get on Xavier, guys. I don't know if he wants to follow me on this journey that I'm going on, but I got so many dates coming up, and uh, we haven't made a video or anything that to promote. What's going on, Xavier? So, uh, hey, if you're out there, I'm looking for an intern. <laughs> Xavier needs an intern, someone that wants to take his job. Yeah, no, I need my own intern now. Right? Yeah. And then that so one, I make flyers. I could turn so that guy into flyers, Xavier. Videos. Yeah, no, I, yeah, we'll call him X with FAG. <laughs> find someone no, for real anybody who wants to h- come help us look at work. the camera though. I'm looking at it right here someone wants to help <laughs> us work help us do videos clips artwork I'll show you how to do it I just need some extra help so get to it yeah everybody um, special announcement uh, oh shit you're gonna tell them nah I'm not gonna tell them that one <laughs> February 13th I'm gonna do the Sancha show at Ooh. Bellflower it'll be me three plates X to the G um, 420, April 20, I'll be at the Upstage Comedy Lounge in San Antonio. Um, when am I in Austin next? February 19th, February 19th, Austin. Yes. 17th. 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 Yo, we're going to make a flyer tomorrow. Hey, everybody. Sorry, man. Been <laughs> super busy, but we're going to come out with new clips, new flyer, new videos. And also, uh... Fool's Gone Wild's doing a show, a mystery show, dog. Hey, for they haven't even hit me to be on it. I, I don't know who's going to be on this show. They got a mystery yeah. lineup. It's almost sold out at the Comedy Store. When is it? Oh, they didn't tell December, you. December 28th. 28th. No, like, the Comedy Store was just like, hey, uh, did, is this your show? And I'm like, no, that's Fool's Gone Wild. 
And they're like, well, they hit us up to do a show. And I was like, hey, they put mystery hey, lineup. And I was like, get down. That's dope for them. So I just, not all my fans follow Fools Gone Wild. Not all your fans follow Fools Gone Wild. And not all your fans follow Fools Gone Wild. So I would hate for our, because mostly our fans are in Southern California. And he's doing a show at the Comedy Store, dog. Yeah. He's hosting it. Yeah. Like, Little Mystery is going to host crazy. the That's show, sick. dog. Yeah, like, yeah. And I don't know who's going to be on it. Little Mystery, if you're watching, pal, <laughs> throw, throw me some minutes. Eh? <laughs> Yo, X, plug. Hit that like button, subscribe, get us to 20,000 subscribers, and uh, go to samtriple.com. Go get those hats and those beanies that I just put up there. Go put me to work. And uh, what's up, Tommy? Check us out on Holding It Down with Three Plates on Instagram and Biz Official on YouTube. Don't forget, guys, uh, holding it down with three views. Make sure, you, yeah, make sure you guys go watch that podcast. And uh, also, uh, Xavier's going to be starting a new church called uh, Aliens of God. <laughs> and you guys want to go? <laughs> I got Miracle it today, aliens. dog. Right? And the sun. The U, the F, the O. Jesus going to come Jesus after you. Jesus is going to fucking strike you right now. Oh, Wait till I leave, is, Jesus. Oh, yeah. He's going to beam you up, dog. That's why you can't get deported because you got beamed over here. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, everybody. This is George Press Stories, episode 340. I want to thank my guests, X to the G and BZZT, Three Plates Tommy. Chopping it up. Having a good time. We're going to have another guest for you guys next week. Uh, look at everything else. Take a shower, brown power. I gotta go. What's up, my boy? From that city with juice, ain't no pity or truces. When we dip in gun smokes, conclusive. Don't act clueless, hella bullish in the 90s. And GP shotgun, when we ride. Solid on the yard, name hard on these streets. Did my crimes, gangster rhymes on dope beats. Still fuck laws, ain't no pause in our demeanor. Rest in peace, Muggsy and my road dog creeper. Ways to put it down, no fear of new cases. Years ago, though, it was guns and chases. 714 on my shoulders, kept it active. Roll like soldiers, G code ain't passive. Still mac and rack, still packed at the waist. Still stacking racks, still flash when they hate. Now it's podcasts and videos with pretty hoes. Me and George banging orange till the city's known. Really though. OG1. We keep it moving smooth like every day. In this industry, so take a look, take a look. How we do we on these streets for sure? Streets for sure. We make the green, don't you go, go, go. We make it moves all day, all day, all day, all day. Grew up in the streets of the LB. We don't love these hoes, what they tell me. Packed up and moved to the OC. Me and George born in life, Shaq and Kobe. Fuck bitches get money, living wealthy. Bad bitches screaming, let me get a selfie. Big stop, she be some real G. Side dick is the general of an army. Egg she podcasting in the morning. Don't say F A is your warning. That other bullshit be boring. With some goofy ass question, that's corny. Tommy, let me finish my story. Shooting shots, game six, rubber ore. Smoking blunts in the bus while I'm touring. Now welcome to George Perez Stories. OG Way. We keep it moving smooth like every day. Every day. They take a look at home and we don't go. We don't go. It's going down for sure, for sure. Real G's in this industry. So take a